What the fuck? <laughs> that, that text, was, that screw was so bright. <laughs> Can you read the text? What the fuck? <laughs> what an intro. So many things happening now. That is more fitting to the game. <laughs> like the sitcom into a intro free. Wait, what the fuck just happened in that intro? <laughs> what did we just witness? A good people trip is what we witnessed. Brightness. I don't know, we'll see what it looks like when we get into the game. What happened? Oh, you heard all such a strange breathing noises and everything? Oh, it's just the intro for this game. Oh, it's just the intro video for this. I'll show you. Hmm. Oh, wait, these are just the controls, I think. Oh, yeah. Well, let's see how dark this game is, like lighting-wise. Did we forget to mess with brightness settings? I think, uh, hold on. What happens if I lower the brightness settings in here? What the fuck is this happy, strange happy music? That's the default brightness settings for this. Yeah, I mean, we can see what this looks like once we get in game if it's too dark or not. No shade. <clears throat> yeah, here we go. Easy, normal. Normal. No, there's no riddle difficulty in this one. They, they dropped it on this. Is that the loading screen? <laughs> That strange ghost person floating. It was two years ago that Henry Township moved into a room 302 of South Asheville Heights. An apartment building in the medium-sized city of Asheville. Henry was happy and enjoying his new life. But five days ago, something strange happened. He began to have a recurring dream each night. One, after, one thing after another. He couldn't leave room 302.
Go over in third, first person. Go to options. Yes. First person Silent Hill. No, the max is eight and there's not seven. What's with this room? Ah! <laughs> what? Excuse me? <laughs> they step on someone? Own blood and rust. This is my room, but what the hell has happened to it? It's a room. Was it really in my room? In terrible shape. And yes, so heavy my head hurts. My head hurts. I don't remember putting up this photo. This church. That's hot to see that that's a church. Oh, I can't leave. See, so yeah, I was expecting the eye to pop up again. I left the TV on. <laughs> My old square TV. What does big TV come from? But I had a record player here. The window, I can't get it open. Is that me? Where's this photo? It's all faded and I can't see it well. Rust everywhere in this damn apartment. Not interested in food at all. My head, it hurts. It hurts. I feel like washing my hands right now. That's horrible. I'm afraid to open it up. an old picture book that once was a baby and a mother who were connected by a magical cord one day the cord was cut and the mother went to sleep baby was left alone baby made lots of friends at wish house and everyone was very nice to him baby was happy it's ripped here and i can't read anymore what? Interesting.
I don't have anything to say about the note. These shoes, they're not even my size. The door shut for good. I should tell it won't open at all. Well, I guess we'll go watch some snow. On the TV. I don't even know what this is. <laughs> what? All these people. 21 people? It can't be. Why are they here? <laughs> you have anything to say about the ceiling fan? Oh my god, what the fuck? <laughs> Creepy, it looks like a face. Did I? I don't think. Did I click on that? I don't think so. Wait, what? What's that? You don't move with the D pad in this? What happened? <laughs> Are we waking up? Just happened. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> what the fuck is happening? You tell me what the hell is that? <laughs> what? Can I just emerged emerged from the walls? Fucking creepy man. Yep, that was the game right there. That, yeah, this, this was a short one, boys. Now I want to do DBD. <laughs> Not DBD. Yeah, DBD. Someone's got to keep DBD warm. But you are keeping it warm right now. <laughs> oh man. What a dream. Oh god, was that first person? Is that whole game in first person? Not everything looks normal now. I believe this is Henry, what they called him in the intro. Oh, I didn't know I had to pick up the phone. <laughs> I thought he was going to say something to it. It's 
still not working. Probably get that checked out. Oh, that now magically works. Hello? Hello, hello? Help me. What? Not even Sports card. locked in. You're going crazy, Henry. Oh, I can actually call someone. It's called deaf. One one two. Oh, was it nine one one? I forget. I don't know. It seems like they took this silent hill in a different direction. Trying out something new. This is a picture. Of, this is a photo of the church I ran across while I was visiting Silent Hill. For some reason I was really attached, attached by the way it looked, so I took the picture. There are a lot of small items here, but none of them is particularly interesting. Oh, the outside world, that's normal. Why is that guy sprinting? All of a sudden, we're playing GTA. <laughs> is that girl waiting for someone? Or is... Yeah, she's going down now. I just didn't see a lot of those in the last few games. Yep. The first Silent Hill with more than like five humans, actual real humans, and everything is normal. <laughs> this is all Henry does all day, just stare out his window. Mm. Cool. Oh, I can stalk my neighbor too. Neighbors. Likes the uh, peepers. I don't see anyone though. I don't forget anyone's home. And Leox the uh, peepers too. There you go. <laughs> A stalking on peepers. Oh, I see some movement down there. Uh, maybe they're just rolling around in bed. Hmm. What about the other window? Can't open the window. Up until a few days ago, it was no problem. Ever since I started having those nightmares. Oh, you love the Ayayagers. Ayayagers. Been the Ayaya. Brand new scrapebook. You view the content of the scrapbook by pressing triangle. What? So I haven't gotten anything. Oh. You're not holding anything. Oh. <laughs> oh. My room is normal now. Oh, 
apartment. Wait, so if that's the door I came out of, what is this door? Ah, oh, the bathroom. Nothing to do here. He says we're looking at the toilet. I don't feel like washing my feet right now. I want to look myself in the mirror. I can't. The normal bathroom. Nothing has changed since I moved here two years ago. It's your standard bathroom. Don't have anything to say about the note. The main power is off, so even if I press it, nothing happens. What? So weird. A few days ago, the power to my TV and my VCR just cut out. Ever since I started having those nightmares. And now the news. In Washington. A gathering of 200,000 people appealing for stricter gun control laws in the wake of a spate of violent shootings throughout the country turned tragic when shots were fired into the crowd. Two people were killed and several wounded, including a three-year-old child. At this moment, no suspects have been found. Police are investigating the source of the shots. Very messed up. Oh God, turn that off. Clock stopped working a few days ago. Yo, there's people. Yeah, that person in the bottom right is in his bed. What is that guy doing? At the top. Is he also just <laughs> looking out of his window? Talking people in my apartment building? Because this is a this is a different window. Gotta get our binoculars out through all the through, through all the windows. The person on the bottom right is just rolling your air on the bed, and then the top guy he's also just stalking people. Why is everyone sitting on their bed? That top person looked like they had a discussing in an argument with someone. Hotel Ta Hotel South Ashfield. Wait, can I call that number? Bar Southfield 55375. Hold on, let me write that down. I want to see if we can call it on the phone. This is a scrape from some book. I mean, this thing looks like it was written ages ago. Through the ritual of the Holy Assumption, he built a world it exists in a space separate from the world of our Lord. Miraculously, it is within, yet without the Lord's world. Like the world of our Lord, it is a world in extreme flux. Unexpected doors or walls, moving floors, old creatures, a world only he can, he can control. 
And anyone swallowed up by that world will live there for eternity. Undying. They will haunt that realm as a spirit. Can our Lord forgive such an abomination? Part of the book is too damaged to read. It is important to travel lightly in that world. He who carries too heavy a burden will regret it. The book is too damaged to read anymore. Did I go call the... Have you put the book... Book scrap in your scrapbook? Uh-huh. There's a lot of locks in my door. Hold on, I want... This chest could hold a lot of stuff. What the? I don't have anything right now. What is this, Resident Evil now? We got an item box. <laughs> I want to see if I can call this place. I mean, the phones are not plugged in, so probably not, but I'll have to try. Yes, okay, thank you. And how much would that be? That noise just now. What was that? Is that my health in the top left? What the fuck? Okay, that's the save point. How many save slots we got in this? Already? Hit me with number 27. Room 302. I got this photo from Frank Sunderland. Super here at South Asheville Heights. What? <laughs> Frank Sunderland? He perhaps related to James? The photo of me as a kid, and then when I graduated from high school. And a tissue box next to it. I don't really feel like cooking right now. I feel like washing my hands right now. Chocolate milk here. Take the chocolate milk. I close it. I don't want the chocolate milk to go bad. Can I not close the fridge again? Nope. Oh. Ah, there you go. Close it by itself. What's this room? Oh. Five days ago. That's when I first had the nightmare. I've been able to get out of my room since then. The phone doesn't work. The TV doesn't work. I can't even get anybody to hear me from here. My whole world has suddenly turned insane. My door's chained up. The windows are sealed shut. On top of that, someone chained the door from the inside. How am I going to get out of here? 
Don't go out, Walter. Who the fuck? What the hell? Yeah, who's Walter? What's going on here? Peeping at the people. That's Ellen Galvin from next door. Changes before the party. Well, help me, ma'am, please. I'm trapped in my own house, my own apartment. That's sixteen hands. Jesus fucking Christ, what was that? What was that? What I'm seeing. What's in this room? At the washing room. There are tools and things on the ground. Washing machine. I don't need that right now. Right now. There's nothing interesting here at the moment. It's clothes are dryer. I don't need that right now. Why doesn't he... Why, why don't he just break the window? He could easily escape this apartment. Break the window with the chair. And scream out for help or something. Not that hot. If you want to get out, if you really want to get out that badly. What happened? Get over the window. I just, I just want to look out the window. I guess I can't do that anymore. What the fuck? Someone dug a hole into a bathroom. What the hell? S somebody in there? This way. Ah, it's not creepy at all. <laughs> There's a voice is coming from the tunnel. Sewage pipe's broken too. Found the pot hanging. Sure. You got a steel pipe. Steel pipe weapon. Three foot long sewer pipe. Not very powerful, but fairly easy to use. Okay. Knocked over my toothpaste. Can I go save really quick? <laughs> Again. I don't I know not much has happened, but I'm not too safe if we save right now. What am I gonna use this pipe? I'm telling me there's gonna be first person combat. Rip. Huh? Here we go. What was the worst that could happen? 
Enter the hall. It's a tunnel to hell. So bright. Are we going to meet Jesus? And we see the light. The loading icon changed. How did we end up on an escalator? What? What the hell? Oh my god, what? It's no longer first person. I can only control it with the D-pad. What the fuck? That is a big dodge. Yep. Wait, he has stamina? I don't know, some type of stamina thing, a whooping gouge thing in the that circle. Oh. So it's like the South Asheville subway station. I can see you from the apartment. It's all wrong, this shouldn't be here. I need to unequip my pipe or something? <laughs> Can I not run? Oh, there you go, circle. What's this? This looks like South Astro subway station. I don't think this should be here. Again. Who's that at the end? Wait, is that the girl we saw at the window? The girl in the red dress? That was just standing there for so long. She's just <laughs> kind of creepy. She's standing there like a zombie. This is weird. Are you using the D-pad to play this with? <laughs> been... Been using the... D-pad in all the other games and now we have to use the thumbstick. Uh, miss? You good? Who are you? Oh. What's your name?
Henry. What is this you? music? <laughs> this is my dream, and you don't even know my name. It's Cynthia. Your dream. That's right. <laughs> this is just a dream. And a really terrible one, too. I hope I wake up soon. So you think this is a dream, huh? Well, if it's not a dream, what is it? Anyway, I want to get out of here, but I can't find the exit. Say, will you help me find it? I'm kind of scared all alone. I'll do a special favor for you later. <laughs> it's just a dream, so I might as well have some fun. Henry. Oh, I can't use the D-pad. All oh, confused. Like, wow, wow, wow. Who is this woman? This is a dream. What is she saying? Is she the crazy one? Some kind of advertisement. There's nothing interesting about it. Well, uh, Cynthia is still here. Poison. Wait a minute. Oh. 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 I think I'm going to puke. What? <gasps> Convenient, the bathroom's right there. What? What happened to her? I mean, that's the men's room that's opening. I thought it was her coming out. Oh. Demon dog will appeal. I killed that friend. No sudden moves, Henry. Just pretend you're not there. <laughs> Don't pay any mind to them. Oh yeah, I still can't. See, they don't know we're here. I bombed into him and he didn't care. Cynthia, are you in here? What was that? Someone dropped something? I don't think anyone's in here. Where did she go? Where does this crazy hole lead to? Go oh, into the hole. Back in my apartment. What? Another dream. But it seems so real. Or could it be? Was I really inside that woman's dream? 
Oh, that's just stupid. What am I thinking? Just another dream. This is my bed. What about the phone? Does it work now? Oh, I mean, I could try and call this the number again, I guess. Probably just gonna be the same thing. Name the monic sounds. Hmm. Stop calling <laughs> pizza off. <laughs> They're off then. Can you hear me? Hey, Betty. Hi. You reached the hottest hotline in town. Hottest hotline in town, huh? How hot are we talking? How many degrees? Oh, she's no longer there. Oh boy. A thousand degree burn. I'm on W. I'm here. Could end up burning through the phone. The fuck is he doing? He playing air guitar? I did that. I think he's just playing air guitar. <laughs> he just sits down again. <laughs> what the fuck was that? That looked like something straight out of The Sims. I don't know, he just decides to do something random and then sits down again afterwards. Yeah, he just went full on Pepe guitar. <laughs> Pepe air guitar in this case. Is the hole in the wall still going to be here? Monk shake. The hole in the wall is still there. He's saying the same thing again. All of it. Wait, can I look at the window here again? Hell yeah. What is happening up there? The guy's still sitting on his bed. Those two stopped having their argument. Yeah, Kata guy is chilling. Mm -hmm. Oh, let's save again. 
Doesn't seem like anything's changed. In our room. This furniture has been here ever since I moved in. Huh? That's weird. Somebody moved it. Straighten it. I did not even notice that, that it was slightly moved. Yeah, sure. What the fuck? Is that a gun? Who could have done it? There's a pistol on the floor. Yes, I'll take it. You get the pistol. They use handgun, but not much stopping power. Your message carved in here. It looks like they used an ice pick or something. The faint hope I had is slowly changing to despair. I've somehow managed to tunnel this far, but no matter what I do, I can't get any further. The hallway, the windows, the walls. Feels like this room is stuck in another dimension. Eileen never noticed. Eileen. Was that the neighbor? Uh, uh, what? Hmm. Where did I put that damn broom? Oh. There it is. What a creep. <laughs> Wait, she has a, a, a Robbie. She has a rabbit. Robbie rabbit. Peepers the game, yeah, you don't say. First, we're fucking stalking our neighbors out the window. Dangling to the apartment. On the other side, and now, now we're literally peeping through a hole into the next door neighbor. Oh, hey, what's going on in here? <laughs> what the hell? Robbie. No one's calling. Is it the pizza guy? Hello? Hello? Where did you go? Hurry! Save me! If you need a token, there's one here! What? Wait, was that Cynthia? Who the fuck was that? What's that noise behind me? Monk shake? Keep on peepersing on the girl. What? The girl, the girl, like the peephole in the wall? You want me to keep staying for that peephole? Yeah. Oh. Back and forth. What is it? Like an Easter egg? Does it involve Robbie? <laughs> Is it a jump scare? <laughs> I hope it's an Easter egg. Well, yes, so. You want me to back out and then just keep looking and then back out again? Is Robbie gonna move?
effect. Meanwhile, someone's shoveling sand in the background. Maybe I missed it. Maybe you're supposed to do it the first time you do it. And not leave and go interact with the phone like I did. That probably messes it up. What was supposed to happen? Does it, did it involve Robbie? Did it involve the rapid? Oh no. What's this? Mom, why don't you wake up? Why don't you wake up? I'm not mom. Excuse me. Put the first letter in your scrapbook. Who the fuck is shoveling sand? Wait, is it a her cleaning? Why is there sand in the hall? Peeping once again. That for the people on the door. Can't open the door. <laughs> really, no. Why not? Definitely not because there's like a million chains on it. Well, let's crawl through the hole again, I guess. What the fuck? Now that is fucking creepy. <laughs> what kind of mannequin? Got a coin in its hand. Take the coin. Please don't kill me. Got the Lynch Street Alliance coin. Main tokens for the subway. The subway's the Lynn Street line could be used any number of times. Creepy. It sort of reminds me of Cynthia. <laughs> that is creepy. There it is again. The noise of someone dropping something. Hey, how's it going? No need to use this now. Looks like there's no one in there. Hmm. Oh, oh, oh. 
I didn't mean to enter combat stance. It's a coin dispenser for the Lynch street line. If it's broken, I can't use it. We gotta find the one that works. What? What the fuck happened? Calm down with the creepy music. Some kind of station guide. The next the text is all blurry. It's totally useless. It's the King Street line entrance. That was weird. <laughs> How the music went crazy all of a sudden. What the fuck? Is that a giant worm? Go shut tight, won't open it all. You'll be able to get out of the street this way, but it's dead end. Oh, the worm doesn't mind? Okay. Excuse me. Up, 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 up. Oh, this is another dead end. Still office. Office? Can I go? Can I go inside the offices? Why does it play the creepy music here? Oh my god! <laughs> that pause. <laughs> Jesus. <sighs> Moments right before disaster. Up 10 pictures taken right before disaster. Need corner get through here. He missed. What does this thing have? Wait, but didn't he say he needs a coin? If it's a, it can be used. How do I use it? <laughs> Can't use that this here. Oh. Where was that dog? Phone? Hey, phone was broken. What? Really? The light is on, though. 
think I should play DBT in Ohio. No, right? Yeah, let's track of how long it's been. Time to get those DBD withdrawals. And I'll be back. I'll be back soon. I'll be back next week when the new chapter comes out. Who's breathing heavily? Is it him? Oh yeah, he's. Why is he exhausted? We've just been jo We've just been walking around. <laughs> Jesus. Oh. Nice. To the map, please. Can I zoom in? I can. Not very much, but I can. Don't think I can't enter the offices from here. Hey, hello there, Mr. Life of Teens. Hello, hello. Found any submarine please around? What did he say? Didn't he say this is for coins? He said something when I first clicked on it. Why is he exhausted again? Kind of low on health, but we haven't found any heals yet. Maybe some of these work? That's broken. It's a coin dispenser. Ah, uh, yes, yeah, so that means it gives us coins. But we already have the coins, so why is he not... Why is he not using them on the thing? Here? What do you mean you can't use that here? You're in the car? You're going for a ride? You're going for a road trip? A road trip with your Danish passport? Put that to good use? Be used any number of times. Linge Street. Linge Street. Yeah, I mean, there should be for here. There you go. Jesus. Wow, that had to be so specific. I thought I had to click on the other little metal box that looked like a coin box next to me. No, we had to be staring at this the entrance. That was a bit, a bit awkward to get properly. We got it. We got there eventually. Someone else emerging from the wall. My head. Oh my god. What the fuck? Wait, are they like ghosts? They're floating. What in the... <laughs> Wait, what is he doing? Guy left and came back. Okay. 
What? <laughs> Wait, how did they die? Did he, did he bleed out or something? Because he didn't hit me. I was hitting him. Unless you traded, I guess. Where's this continue going to put me? Well, I should probably go grab that handgun ammo. I... I'm just gonna run past the dogs. Because the pipe is fucking horrible against them. I feel like this might... I feel like this might be the hottest one of them all. But this might be the hottest I've heard of them all. We played so far. It's because it, I don't know. It's because it plays so differently. In melee, it seems a lot harder. But if I've learned anything from Silent Hill Three, that I gotta save. Fuck. Is that I gotta save up all my ammo. So we're trying to use the pipe as much as possible. Now that's annoying. <laughs> he was body blocking. So we try to avoid as many enemies as possible. And use the pipe as much as possible. Man, these are ghost enemies are pretty creepy. In this. Oh wait, I take damage just from being here. That's what happened before. Yeah, he takes damage just from being here. Just gotta go. That's Cynthia? Oh, it is. I don't know how I can help you, ma'am. up the door. Now oh, that hurts so late. The button here, will you push it? No. That's the exit? I like like the front. I think it's just because of the way that it's camera's placed. Yeah, sure, push it. Looks like the car door's opened. Why is it so squishy in here on the floor?
What is happening right now? Take that, you silly ghost. Don't touch me. That actually kill it? Seems like it. Eighteen. Strange vending machine. It says eighteen on it. Write it down. Write that down. <laughs> eighteen. Demonic 18. Well, I guess we're just leaving? I guess I should check inside the train, maybe? I left just at the right time. <laughs> Another ghost showed up. My head, it hurts. There's a toy box here. It has a thousand written on it. A thousand. Write that down. Write that down. It's locked and I can't open it. What the hell is going on right now? the hell? Wait, what is it? I can't even tell what that is. <laughs> is that dead corpse or is it mannequin? Oh, it's still so squishy in here. Did, did we make it to another station? We accidentally went the right way. Wait, was I too fast? What happened? Oh, shit, let me hear. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> what makes you say that? I, I, th I think you're typing in the wrong chat. This is this is Leo's chat, not, not Mr. Junior's chat. I, I think you meant to type that in his, in his chat room. Wait, did I lose her? Or so is it maybe supposed to happen? I don't know. Well, let me go back to the creepy room. It 
Ten Fia just vanished. Should I go down? No. I'm assuming if I go through this hole, I'm going to wake up again. And then we can go save. I'm assuming that's what this means. Wait, yeah, how how's Mr. Junior doing with this game? Is he still playing it? Yeah, that does wake you up going through that hole. I see, I see, I see. Oh wait, that heals you too. Okay. Hmm. Which I'm guessing there's like no healing items in this. Maybe you just have to yet yeah, wake up from the nightmare and then go back. Interesting. Now let's do some more peeping. Akita man is still going strong. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> well, speak of the devil. There he is. He was listening in this whole time. Ah, yeah, you're almost done. You just stuck at the moment. This is lurking and chatting. It all good, Mr. Junior. Well, I hope you'll be able to get through it today. And get past the point where you're stuck. So far, I mean, we're still yeah, not even that far into the game. We're only like an hour and a half into it, but so far, I'm kind of digging this. That yeah, we're just stuck in this room. Got to figure out how to come out, and then I'm really liking these new mechanics. The new mechanic that yeah, you have to wake up from one nightmare to come through our apartment and save and heal too. It seems. Robbie, he's still there. Wonder if he has a bloody mouth. Not too interesting peeping on our neighbors this time. We're all mostly sleeping. And there seems to be nothing new. Kind of odd we have an item box though. <laughs> That's a bit strange. That wasn't in any of the other ones. Looks like we're playing Resident Evil now. They're sent further into hell. Party. Yeah, we have like an item box in our house. Cause I feel like we're playing Resident Evil. Up. There's the other part of Wormy.
You got it, chief. He's coming. Who's coming? What the hell? Oh, bitch slap down the escalator. What am I supposed to get past you? No, I, I can't stop fast enough. I'm too fast. How long is this escalator ride right of hell? <laughs> the worst possible timing. I'm gonna die. That's fine. Because I don't want to use the heal. I yeah, well, made it. Made it after getting hit like seven times on the way up. Women's makeup items are scattered on the ground. This must be synth, yes. Gosh, she carries a lot of makeup. There's a plate on the door. Remove the plate. Got the temptation plate card. What? From Subway World. It shows a woman and says temptation. Oh, fucking rib, Jesus. Looking like a crime scene in here. Are you okay? Oh. It's just a dream, right? Oh. I think I drank too much last night. got to do that special favor for you I I feel like I'm dying Rip Cynthia. Bally Neuer. That was that was so sad with the music. How emotional. <gasps> yeah, exactly viable for what a sad scene. Someone's already dead? That's early on? What the fuck? Rip Cynthia. At least she had enough time. To write the code on her boob. 16... 16... Uh, 121. Oh? Man. What's that noise out there?
I don't know, let's go peep out the window and find out. Hey, now we're fully healed. Eat. <laughs> Do I have Xbox and DVD on it? <laughs> Whatever, random question. Well, yeah, I do have an Xbox. An Xbox One. And surprisingly, yeah, I do have DVD for it. <laughs> for the Xbox. There's an ambulance and a police car near the subway entrance. Is it Cynthia? Oh, shit. Did she get murdered down there? And it, well, yeah, she thought it was a dream, but it was reality. There's that running man again. Oh my god. <laughs> Does that mean you can put Xbox DVD in your second... To get an off-road bingo win? I mean, yeah, I get... Actually, no, you can't do that, because... You can pick any game, as long as it's a PlayStation, so it has... It has to be on, on PlayStation. You, you can't pick an Xbox game. Even... Even Xbox DVD, you know? You, you can't pick that one. I'm, I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Rips in fear. No PC DVD either. Yeah, I'm, I'm afraid you can't pick that either now. Yeah, it has it has to be on PlayStation. That's the one rule. <laughs> Wait, what? I didn't know I could do that. He's like knocking on the window right now. Let me, let me just tap axe. Help me, I'm stuck in this damned building. Right, enough peeping. That's some clever thinking though, Mr. Dante. Some clever thinking. <laughs> Try to chase the system. Get even more DVD options on there. I wonder what the code's for that she gave us. Hurry up and get that ambulance. Quit yapping and move her already. What the? Damn. She's got numbers carved into her chest. I wonder if... That like a serial killer that leaves numbers in that body in that car in the victim's body. Monkey shake. Monkey shake shake. We shaking. Time to do some more peeping. Hey <laughs> hey. Robbie. What if I try and do the thing now that Boxy said? Maybe it happens now. I kind of doubt it. Oh. <laughs> Does she know? You're looking right over here.
papers. Ouch, they are papers. Is she gonna be like up against the hole now? With her eye? No, no, she's still just sitting there. <laughs> Next time we look through the hole, she's gonna be pointing a gun at it. No, oh, no, she's still just sitting there. Crossing her legs left and right. <laughs> Is she getting her gun now? Really? That many people? You sure you can handle it? Oh, really? Huh? Oh, no problem. So I better start getting ready soon. I told you, no problem. I'll be there. What? Oh, that. Yeah, you're telling me. I really want to find another place soon. There's just... I don't know. Something about this place. Creepy neighbor, and we're the creepy neighbor this time. I'm looking for a peephole into that bedroom. How many? She's probably talking about a party and not anything else. Hey, oh, can you really handle that many people? Can you really handle murdering that many? Probably just the party. No. Monk shake. Are we shaking. She's just gonna be wandering around her, her room now. Really? That many people? Oh no, it's just repeating. Yep, it's just repeats now. One more time just for good measure. It's probably just, yeah, it's a phone call now. Yeah, I'm out. I'm out. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go creep out through the window now. I'm that creepy neighbor that just creeps on everyone and never leaves his room. <laughs> Help me, I've been locked in here. Help me. Let me out. Like someone has intentionally cut off communication. Oh, we have a new thing. I wonder what this is for. Let's grab a red paper stuck in here. But though the cult itself is gone, I'm sure the spirit of it, of it is still alive. There are too many strange things happening in that town. I'm investigating two people. Or maybe I should just say one. We're just about to discover what's going on. Keep relief. What were they discover investigating Cheryl? The imprints are still there. Is that always there in the fridge? I think that's probably just like a menu. Or like a restaurant. Guy only has chocolate milk and wine in his fridge. Oh, oh that's that close one.
We'll save just in case, and I guess we'll crawl through the hole again. I wish I could look at this. You know, inspect it. I wonder what I have to do with it. One's more. The hole's getting bigger. Oh. Oh. I didn't even notice that. We're outside now. Scary. It is quite scary. We're all of a sudden outside now. Well, at least he can get some fresh air. A hole bigger, yeah, the hole's getting bigger. Don't you just hate it when your hole gets bigger? Quite annoying. Too dark to see. Can't read this writing. Uh, what? There's another hole to get back. That light, is that an enemy? Fucking is. Swat it with my pipe. What? What the fuck? Quadra kill. I hate that there is a yes and no option now for picking up handgun ammo. <laughs> oh. They all take up, uh... Take up separate slots now, they don't stack the handgun ammo. At least the box are not super tanky. Sorry, hit the mic.
can't read this writing. It's just still running and the driver's seat door's open. Start with the brake pedal engaged. There are all sorts of things scattered on the seat. Among the trash is a scrap of paper with something written on it. It's been a while since I came here to Silent Hill. Maybe I'll meet the devil this time. Whenever I came, I come to a cool place like Silent Hill, I always get real thirsty. Jasper. Jasper guy. It's a memo pattern there too. Fuck is Jasper. Fuck, I didn't read the first bit. Jasper's memo pattern. Thank god that saved. I'm not sure what that nosy guy meant when he said his home is the orphanage in the middle. The lake is northwest. So the opposite is southeast. The noisy guy uh, said one thing, said one other thing I don't understand. If you bring the dug up key, you can't go back. Put it away somewhere before you return here. There. This, all of that sounds really important. Like if not for us, the opposite is southeast. Sounds really important. No, is that him? Is that Jasper? So you, you came to investigate this, this stone too. There, there was a, another guy here before, a, a, a real nosy guy. But, but, but I, I was the one, one who found the stone first. In the old days. Natives called it na Nakihona. They used it in a, a, a ceremony for, for talking with their dead ancestors. And now those those guys are, are using it too. Call, call it the Mother Stone. They're just uh, up, up ahead in that, that weird building. Op operating some kind of crazy re religious cult. They used to c c collect or orphans and, 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 and d d did things to them. Kind of gives you the chill chills, huh? This stone. Are you so nervous, buddy? Meanwhile, Henry didn't see a single thing. <laughs> didn't respond at all. This crazy man. Can't see. So maybe he's just scared of the cult. This rock is creepy somehow. Demon doggo. What the fuck? Okay. Well, glad I didn't go sprinting in there. What the hell is that? Oh my god, of course you had to turn. Oh my, what in the Jesus. Diana Hill's Smile Support Society, Wish House. It's the orphanage. It's the orphanage run by the cult, huh? What did it say on the door? I was just, I, why would you put text there? I'm spamming X to get through the door because I don't want to get bombarded by all those doggos. I mean, there is a thing here, so we could go back and save. Yeah, you know what? We might as well make use of it, I suppose. Mm 
It's like a graffiti drawn by a kid. I mean, since it's here, since the hold to return to my, from the dream is here, I might as well make use of it. Might as well, right? And get a free heal on top of it, too. The ambulance still there? No. <laughs> I don't know why, but I find that so funny. Him just slamming in the window like a madman. <laughs> just help me, let me out, and screaming. And no one notices him. It's like it's, it's like he doesn't even exist. <laughs> help me. <laughs> What? Is that someone at the door? Can't open. Wait, it's her. Help me! Help! Let me out of here! It's a neighbor. There's something going on in this room. What do you mean? I heard weird noises coming from inside there. Help! Hey, Richard. Can you see yeah. anything from your window? No. Everything looks pretty normal to me. The guy who lives here, what's he like anyway? I know his name and face, but that's about it. Well, I'm gonna go call the super. Yeah, good idea. Damn it, they can't hear me. You know what? If you, man, if you just were the tiniest bit of smart, Henry, you would slip a note under the door. Like, come on now. <laughs> you, you have gotten two notes slipped to you from under the door. So if you were just the tiniest bit of smart, then you could just, you know, write help me on this notepad and slide the note under the door or something. Come on, man. That was your prime opportunity. I'm not gonna get another opportunity like that to save. Not for someone to save you. I'm gonna hit me right now. Use your brain. Use your five hit, man. Not time to be a creep once again. Robbie. Yeah, obviously she's not here because we just saw her in the hallway. Forehead. That's Henry right now. He's being a forehead. He could easily have slid a note under the door for them to be like, Help me, I'm stuck in here. Get the police or something. But no, instead he's just banging on the door like, No, help me. I'm stuck in here. Help me. <laughs> So if he used his five head instead of his four head, he he could have been out right now. <laughs> but no, he's just he's just a silly four head. No five no five head to be seen here. Right, well, let's head back.
Ah, yeah. We're right back here. Sweet. The outside is filled with dangerous things. If someone goes outside without an adult's permission, the master is sad. Must be some kind of kid's toy. Say, sign. Then Hill somewhere else about Society White House. That, that's your, oh wait, that's what he said earlier too. The swing, it looks like it hasn't been used in a long time. Weird writing here too. Let me have some kind of weird writing. Are you not gonna read it? No, I guess he says it's weird, so I guess he can't read it, just like with the rocks. Oh wow, there's four other, uh, there's three other doors here. Uh, the main door's probably locked, right? Yeah, figured. This opens. Oh. Demon dog of hell. Wait, where am I now? Yeah, okay, this is a completely new section. What happened here? Do you have anything to say about the bloody tree? Sorry, Grandpa. I didn't mean to wake you up. Another hole. <laughs> what? Bloody tree, just normal things. Yeah, you're dressed as per usual. Then you go for a nightly stroll, or even a or even a morning stroll through the woods. And you just see a bloody tree. Yeah, it's, it's the usual, the normal things. Normal things you see. Oh, I see what you linked. Is that what is that what was supposed to happen in the? Yeah, when we were peeping. <laughs> oh, I'm sad. Sucks you didn't get that. That's cool. He turns around and points at me. <laughs> oh well. Thank you for linking it though. So we got to see it. He turns around, just points at you. You, I know you're watching. I know what kind of creep you are, Henry. <laughs> Some calves are kind of rib writing. I know what kind of creep you are, Henry. You can't hide it. Is that a golf club? It's a golf club. Looks like a six iron. Can I use it as a weapon? Golf club. Powerful and easy to use, but looks like it could break easily. Uh. Also, that's why that's here, so I can go back and dump the golf club. I guess.
Wait, what the? An arm coming up from the ground? Oh man, thank god. It's just a tree root. <laughs> that is one ominous looking tree root. Oh, creepy. This game is addicted to its golf. Yeah, you wanna go golfing? Who wants to go golfing? Who wants to go golfing in Silent Hill? Anyone? Oh, I didn't even notice that. That's there's more bloody trees here. Ah. Oh, wait, I thought there was more. I want to walk around on, but no. this there are some long hand handled tools here what is that they look like a tree or something oh no oh i think it's just metal pipes it just looks like a, i don't know the tree that's like cut in half what's this what could this be here for Uh. Uh. What? Get up too fast. Probably should have just ran past them, but yeah. I wanted some freedom to explore. Why are these pipes useful? It's the thing on the other side of the wire netting. My god, it stinks. It's nothing interesting, but. But, but what? What were you gonna say? What are they doing with this? that Colton involved in all of this? Mm -mm. Oh, is that Silent Hill, the rest of the town on the other side? The lake? Toluca Lake. Yeah, but buddy's missing. Was it some kind of goddess or something? No save point here. There's a weird writing here too. What? It's strange. <laughs> Why does he crouch down to? He like crouches down like. Let's see if but let's see let's see if he's gonna pick something up. <laughs> I 
There's four different save points here. What? Why are they so generous with the saves? I mean... If you're being so generous with them, I might as well use someone. They're preparing me for something. Yeah, I mean, that's what it feels like. Like, if we're gonna have a first boss or something coming up, what's going on here? Making me, making me feel kind of nervous. With so many save points, it's like... Four save points almost back to back. Boss save points like right, like one right after another. What's up with that? You weren't this generous in the other games. <laughs> Hey, you get your popcorn ready. Oh, well. They should have been ready since like two hours ago. <laughs> oh, yeah, good to see you're enjoying your popcorn. But this last Silent Hill game of the marathon. Slowly pay beating that pay that player base. <laughs> Think so? I don't know. PS2 games, they were hot back in the day. They're pretty ruthless. But I guess but I mean this is one of the later Silent Hills. One of the later PS2 Silent Hills. So who knows? Yeah, maybe. Maybe they make maybe they made this one like a bit easier. Who knows? It certainly plays a bit different compared to compared to the other ones. It certainly plays a bit different because yeah, and this one you move around with the analog stick, and all the other ones you move around with the D-pad. Oh, you can you can move around with the analog stick in the other games, but I just prefer the D-pad because it's more it was more natural with like all the camera angles and the tank controls. But also, I gotta say, man, we gotta play more of these types of games. <laughs> they are so chill and cozy to play. Like, like, oh, wait, I forgot to dump my golf club or whatever. Like, they are so chill and cozy to play. Wait, was this here before, too? With how, yeah, like, yeah, there's no, there's no music or anything right now. It's just the sound of the dirt when I'm walking around. There's no, like... Annoying background music. Gotta play more survival horror games like this. I have a few others we could play. Portable medical kit. Didn't even know that was there. There's a game called Obscure that we could maybe play. At some point. That's also, that's also sort of similar to these old Silent Hill Resident Evil games. Obscure. Man, Reap does writing. I haven't seen that place in a while. Took a trip there a few years back. There was a photo of the lake in my room. 
to look at a lake inside the hill. It's beautiful, but also sad somehow. Oh, I guess that's why there's a save point here. There is that med kit that I picked up, and that's why they put the save point in case you want to, like, oh, I guess. In case your inventory is full and you got to go back and dump something and then come back so you can grab the med kit. I didn't even see that was there, though. Only saw it because we came back. <laughs> don't hit me, please. Thank you. Alright, well, there's one more door we still gotta go through. Welcome to the chat room. Thanks, Twitch. Blood on the pathway. More normal things that you see every day in the forest. A wound. Another ghost. Wait, see, there's another hole here. You see this shit? One, two, three, four. There's five fucking save points here. What? They are really being generous with that. Holy shit. Who the fuck are you? Oh, this isn't a cut. Oh, there you go. Now the cutscene begins. Hey, little boy. What are you doing here? You're... Finally, the third revelation. Something's gonna happen. That nosy guy that was here, he said it too. Something big is gonna happen. Finally, it's gonna happen! <laughs> what? <laughs> what a strange encounter. Just a random child standing here and we're like, Hey, uh, what are you doing here? And then that crazy conspiracy guy shows up. It's gonna happen, it's gonna happen. And then he runs off and so does the kid. What? And the kid didn't even say a word. <laughs> what an odd encounter. Having a stone, it says, best wishes for Wish House. There's a cliff on the other side of the fence. I can't go any further. That is a close up and a half. One, one, two, one. It's another number. What are all these numbers? Maybe we should try these on the phone. Can we, like, call them or something? A grave has been dark here. On the bottom of the coffin are the numbers. One, one, two, one. All numbers, huh?
You know, I kind of want to try that really quick. Let's go back and see if we can call these numbers on the phone or something. I don't think so. I don't think we can. But it's worth a try. I don't, because I don't think the numbers are long enough. They need to be seven digits. That was only five. But it's worth it to try. So let's let's try the first one. One six one two one. No. I wonder what these numbers are for. Definitely not for this though. And, and punch it in correctly. Yeah, no, nothing happens. Oh, well, that's okay. It's at least it's not completely a waste of time that we came back here because I wanna. I want to dump the golf club. <laughs> then that's you. Robbie, can we get the Robbie thing? Probably not. She's probably gonna. Re Wait, she already appeared. What? I didn't even. I didn't even leave. Let me leave. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, the phone is like the only place that we can punch numbers into. Turn from Forest World. Sorry for yawning. What the fuck? <laughs> not creepy at all who's the real creep now him just peeping through all people Back through my hole. Wait, you can actually skip that? Didn't think you would be able to. You can, but then you just get to just add that. Huh. It's like from, from, like from the outside, I can't get it open. Of course the door with the ritual sign on is locked.
Wait, if that's a log, then where the fuck did the creep guy go? Conspiracy guy. Mm-hmm. Well, we've gotten through all the areas. Now it's just time to explore them all properly. I guess we could try and go back to the car, maybe. He'll say something. If he's still there. Oh, he's here. What are you doing? The, 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 the door won't open. It sure won't. That nosy guy g g gave me something really good. I, I, I could let you have it, but, 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 but not for free. I'm really thirsty. I'm so, so thirsty. Oh, chocolate. Oh, chocolate. <laughs> well, you want some chocolate milk, buddy? I got you. I got you. You want some chocolate milk that I got in the fridge? Oh, I'll be back. Let me just crawl through this hole of hell, and then I'll give you- then I'll get your chocolate milk for you. Why is he stuttering all of a sudden? <laughs> he didn't do that before, did he? Like, in the cutscene with the kit. I wonder if there's gonna be a stat at the end of the game. But like how many times you woke up, <laughs> how many times you returned to your apartment. Oh yeah, right, I have two. Uh, let's get this guy's chocolate milk. How convenient to just have some chocolate milk in the fridge. Very sweet. There's in the refrigerator at home. Go save again. Because we love saving. Never be too safe with the saving. Into the hole once more. Almost spilled his chocolate milk on the ground. Oops. Here you go, buddy. Here's your chocolate milk.
Yeah, he's just chucking that. Holy shit. Oh, man. That was awesome. Here, take this. There's something written on it. What the fuck? I thought you were going to give me a key. What am I going to do with that? Shovel my way into the orphanage? It's a small spade with a bloody inscription. Got the bloody inscripted spade. Written in blood is opposite where the lake and house meet inside the hand holding onto the ground. Oh, where we found the... Yeah, I think I know where that is. That's where we found that creepy hand root. And also, he is still chalking that thing. There's a lot of chocolate milk in that tiny little bottle. Oh, it's just endless, I guess. Uh, I think it was this way, right? Yeah. I think it was this way to the creepy hand root. It was near where we found the golf club. What's up, doggies? Now, was it here? I don't think it was. I think it's the next one. Yeah, it's right here. Calm down, Grandpa. The rusted bloody key. I've done this. The hold of this key will wander for eternity now. What in the fuck could that mean? I'm guessing that's for the orphanage. If that's not for the orphanage, then. I don't know what you mean by walk for all eternity. Everything's getting so foggy. Truly entering Silent Hill now. Wait, I'm just going in a circle here. <laughs> I just realized everything's repeating. Hold up. Like we how how are we not there yet? <laughs> Unless it's I mean I think that would sit on like the front door at home. Hold us, he will wonder for eternity. Oh, wait, I get it. It's because I'm holding the key and then we're just going to be stuck in an endless loop. So, the trick is to probably go back, dump the key in the box, come back here, run to the orphanage place, go back through the hole, pick up the key, come back again. Well, that would explain why there's so many fucking holes here and why there's also a hole here. Hmm. Hmm. I see, I see, I see. Pretty clever. Assuming that is the solution. <laughs> Assuming that is what we gotta do. I think you might be here now, too. Uh, 
Nothing new with the door. What about our little peephole? <gasps> Robbie. Oh, can we get Robbie to appear? Oh, well, he's right there. But can we get him to point at us? Oh, what the fuck? No. Never mind. No Robbie. And then we say once more. Help me. What is she doing? She doing yoga? What the fuck happened over there? He just fall behind the trash, the trash, the couch. Yeah, of course he has a church in his own house. Okay, I can tell guy he's going crazy. Hmm. Yeah, well, let's head back. Wait, let's check the peephole again. Ah, the, the creepy old man's up there. Okay, let me go back here and then we're gonna appear where the golf club was. Then we just run back to the orphanage to hop through the hole again, get the key, come back. Assuming that's the solution. Assuming <laughs> that's what will do the trick. of hell. Oh. They're about getting hit. Park. Now we're here again. Guys, are chucking his chocolate milk, of course. I wanted to click on him, but I don't think I can. Right, then we go back out here through the hole once more. Get our key, come back. And unlock the door. And probably save again, knowing myself. Why, is, why does he shove his head so close to the fucking door on the other side? He's like practically kissing it. Uh, how does this work here? No, I didn't want to pick that. God, this menu is a bit strange. How do I go down to other? There we go. Damn. 
Damn it. <laughs> I don't know why I'm still trying it. Probably something you can only do it the very first time. Help me. And anything new on the peep? Peep hole? We have arrived. Yep. And we got our key. Here's the rusty bloody key. And he's still chalking his chocolate milk. Scribbled note. Have you found Alessa yet? How's Walter's progress coming along? Sent me a report. It's a child's drawing. Uh, what the fuck? What are you doing in here? Uh, I wonder what they did here. Hell is this? Uh, I wonder what they did here. So falling apart. It's falling apart, and I can't even read most of the pages. Here's a part I can read. The second sign, and God said, "Offer the blood of the ten sinners and the white oil." Be then released from the bonds of the flesh and gain the power of heaven. If the darkness and void bring forth gloom, then grit thyself with despair. For the giver of wisdom, the third side, and God said, Return to the source through sin's temptation, under the watchful eye of the demon, wander alone in the formless cares. Only then will the four atonements be in. Alignment. Put the holy scribble. Scripture scrap. Need a scrap. What the fuck? Who is steaming in here? There's a plate remover. It's plate on the door. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Remove it. Horse plate. The forge shows a baby and a source. That's probably related to the note I just read. Either these, either we're gonna need these now, or they're gonna come and play later. I'm guessing. Bill, who the fuck is steaming out here? What in the world? How did he catch fire? It's 
stop, drop, and roll, buddy. One seventeen hundred twenty-one. Why did he write that in him? What the fuck? Seventeen twenty-one. Wait, so far we got eleven a hundred. Wait, so far we got eleven. Twelve one and sixteen twelve one, and seventeen twelve one now. The fuck do all these numbers mean? A special news report. In a forest near Silent Hill, the burned corpse of a 30-year-old male was discovered earlier today. The police have ruled it a homicide and are investigating. The numbers 17121 were reportedly carved into the man's body. Due to the marks on the victim, the police are investigating possible links to the Walter Sullivan case 10 years ago. What the hell is happening? <laughs> Am I secretly the murderer or something? <laughs> and then you'll kill them when I like, I'm a blackout or something. And then yeah, he's he's just trying to tr well, yeah he's trying to, he's trying to trap himself in here. That's why all the locks and the doors and everything. But then yeah, he sometimes just blacks out and then goes and goes and kills people. He just doesn't know it. Cause he has like, I don't know, a split personality. What the hell? Well, he badly knew Mr. Jasper too. Well, at least he had one, one chalk with milk. I mean, we already tried calling these numbers. I can't really do that. Mm. Oh. That's a pizza I ordered like five hours ago. What is it? This is the superintendent. Are you in there, Henry? Help me! <laughs> Help me! Something's wrong with this room! Help! Let me out of here! Is anybody home? What's going on here? Yo, is he coming in? If he can find the right key. Has the lock changed? What's happening? He can't come in. something in there. Yeah. That sound. It's the same one as back then. What, then he just leaves? What, is my shit up haunted? Oh wait, there's another hand too on the wall. I didn't even notice that. Are those all the people that he's killed, or what is that? Why? Who added another hand to the wall? Is that his kill count? That was your chance again, Henry. You should have slipped that note. Oh. world. No well, time to do some more peeping. No. 
Nothing new. Definitely no. But what happens if I open the fridge now? <laughs> now that we lost our chocolate milk. Not really lost it, we used it. Wide wine. Yo, I can get the wine now? Who's gonna need wine? We're trying to get drunk. getting even bigger hold on i i don't know if i should dump this but just in case i want to dump these plates so we have some more inventory space yeah there we go All right and actually also before we continue this is a perfect point to quickly Take a nice little break and get some more water. So, be a be gentleman. You know, restock on water and stuff. Yeah, no pink with law. Where? A be a be. Get back. Up.
they time they have returned all right let's continue let's see where the hole takes us now Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, no, I think I already clicked on the radio, didn't I? And now oh, no, I didn't. Yesterday, Wally the Walrus, a longtime resident of the Springfield Zoo, gave birth to a healthy baby walrus pup named Buttercup. Mother and child are doing just fine. Aww. Such wholesome news. Feels good, man. I was blown. It's gotten even bigger and the hole has changed again. And I think I can hear children's voices. They go in, sure. Hey, appreciate the follow, little goosey. Appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Oh, right. Yeah, it's still the D-pad. Oh, the D-pad. The analog stick. What the? Hello? <laughs> who's, who's roaming the halls? Everything's written. I'm sick of being watched. That, that's all he wrote. Look, there's a lot more written than just that, but all right. A fish, wherever it is on the ground. Get me out. Get me the hell out of here. Oh, hey, you're right here. Um, friend, what's your name? She's, she's gonna kill me. Who's gonna kill you? She's gonna kill me. Walter. Are we secretly Walter? He's gonna kill me. Let me break down the prison prison door. My rusty pipe. Oh, it's another hole to go home. How many? There's two. There's two doors in here. I 
It's a sloppily written note. God, I did it again. <laughs> did it again? I accidentally skipped it. God's diary. To get to the surveillance rooms in the middle of this complex, you have to use the corpse disposable chutes in the cells. Excuse me, what? What kind of system is that? <laughs> you have to use the corpse disposable chutes in the cells, however, on the first and second floors. These cells are locked. That's so the kids wouldn't discover them. Kids? You have kids here too? What the fuck kind of place is this? They have to get to the first floor from one of the cells on the third floor. I know how to do it, but it's really a pain. Also, the lights only work on the third floor. Such a pain, you didn't even bother writing it down. Well, we didn't go full circle in here, so... Let's do that really quick. Probably written note on the ground. Luckily, lucky, I finally escaped from the cell. I decided to take a careful look around this building. The scariest place was the first floor basement. This kitchen in the northeast. But the door in the northwest is def is the death chamber. Oh, is this like giving me directions? <laughs> to get in there, you have to push the right numbers. I don't know the numbers. It was too dark to even see the panel, so I didn't need I didn't go in. Exploration memo. He's gonna kill me. Walter's gonna kill me. I know, I know, I know. You already said that. He's gonna kill me. Shut up, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> oh. I got that's what handgun ammo looked like. I thought it was a red doll or something. Graffiti. It looks like the kid's writing. I'm being watched from the middle room. Up that up there. Another door I haven't checked. Lock is broken, I can't open the door. Yep, sure we sure did Dante. Even less than that. <laughs> Even less than that. But yeah, it's it's in it's in the recent highlights in the stream. If you wanna go watch it, check it out really quick, see how long it took. I highlighted it right before the stream, so yeah, if you go to the highlights should be able to see it. It took 11 minutes, I believe. Yeah, let's go back and see. Yeah, it only took us 11 minutes to beat the the final boss. Everything after that was just the cutscenes, the credits, and talking a little bit about the game, and then also unlocking by using that secret code you get at the end. But yeah, it's, it's fair that you missed out on it because yesterday's stream was Omega short, the shortest stream I've ever, the shortest stream I've ever done. It's only like an hour long the stream, and yet then gameplay itself was only thirty minutes. <laughs> I I didn't really, I didn't think I was gonna beat the boss first try, you know. <laughs> I didn't think I was gonna do it on the first attempt. But I thought it was least. I thought it was at least going to take a couple of hours, but no. We did it on our very first attempt, which I did not expect at all. And yeah, I didn't have anything planned afterwards, which is why it was so short. Yesterday's stream. Yeah, 11 minutes. That's how long it took. What's making this noise? Is it the radio? Again?
TV. I don't remember turning this on. I don't remember pressing the button on the remote control. Oh, that you're not gonna turn it off. Turn from water prison world. Water prison. Oh, wait, we got another note over here. Hold on. Let's do some peeping and then we can look at the note at the door. Who slept the note to me? Scrape of red it has a scrap of red paper stuck in here. Lately, I've been feeling like my life is in serious danger. I've been through a lot in my life, but I've never felt this kind of pure animal fear. In case something happens to me, I've decided to write down what I've learned for whoever you are and that's living in the apartment now. I've been stuck investigating the mass murder that took place seven years ago, in which ten people were killed in ten days. They were killed in a variety of ways. The one thing they had in common was that each cop had the following numbers, and all of their deaths kept in them. The name of their killer was kept in as well. Oh shit. <laughs> Wait, so, yeah, is he continuing the murders? Because we have... We've had 16... 16... 12 1 and 11 12 1 and 17 12 1. So, what is it? Are we going to witness seven more murders? His name was Walter Sullivan. April 4th. Am I Walter Sullivan? See my alter ego, <laughs> Walter Sullivan. Let's save again. Oh, wait, I, I forgot the people. What the hell is she doing? What is she doing? <laughs> Looks like she's doing some sort of strange dance. I think she's trying to flood a swy. Flood a swy. Swat a fly. There you go. Why was that so hard to say? Yeah, there, there's 17 hands here now. And the last one we get was 17, 1, 2... One. Oh shit, so this, this is his buddy count, I'm guessing, all the hands. Let's kill count. Sorry, I hit the mic. Uh, well, let's put these handgun bullets in here. Yeah. Woods ball through the hole, shall we?
Alright. We've got a few doors to check out here. No, never mind. We've got one door to check out. What you hit me? I was nowhere near you. <laughs> the way you fell forward. Does this just go in an endless circle? Okay, no, I'm on the other side now. Wait, no, where the fuck? What's going on here? The door seems like it's locked from the inside. How did what? How did I get in here? <laughs> oh, that goes back up. Oh, and I was going down the whole time. Confusing, but I get it. Where in the dimension are we now? Well, I mean, this is a water place. Water prison. What kind of strange pr prison is that? It's a key. What? Got the water person exit key. Up is carved into it. Second floor basement. Oh, is that for the door I ran into him, I guess? What the? Why is there so much blood in here? Oh, wait, hold on. There was another hole in there? Wait, where, where the fuck does this go? It's a massive door. Can't open it very wide. Thank God this is what, wherever I am. It's saying there is a hole in here. Oh, it's back here. <gasps> I mean, hey. If you're being so generous with it, might as well. <laughs> Go back, regain our health. Then come back and run through the... The whole thing. Big a box. They're just as annoying as really light in as in real life these box. Except from the much except from they're much bigger in this game compared to real life. But they're still just as annoying. <laughs> What the fuck? What the hell, Dante? That that's so random to say. 
to both of us. That statement doesn't even make any sense. That's what basically the same at this point. <laughs> he does everything I do, and, and I do everything that he does. That, that statement doesn't even make any sense. We're, we're the same person at this point. Ugh, okay. Oh, I had to sneeze. Now it's just a habit to look out the window every time. Help me, I'm stuck in this building. Get me out of here. Does that need to make sense? That's fair. All good. Doesn't have to make sense. I see you in a bit, Mr. Yante. I wonder you know what Junja's response is going to be. Ooh. Wait, that didn't even damage me. I frames, uh, fuck. I frames for the win. Now gonna be the hell out of you. Uh, Thank God they don't do like insane damage. Uh, yeah, they like belly do any. Can you see the door? All right, so that circle a bit here is a bit confusing to me. Wait, what if I don't take the ladder and I just run? Probably a bad idea because, yeah, those things from the wall are going to show up. Uh, it just looks like I'm running in an endless loop now. He falls forward. Looking like he slipped in a banana. Wait, but where was the door? Hold on, was it up? Is it further up in that case? No, wait, no, this is not the place, because yeah, this is where we came from. Wait, does does the key work here? Oh, it was for here. Okay. Well, there you go. What the fucking Jesus Christ. So bright up here. Because all the fog. Alright, come here. You want some? Stupid bucks. You want a taste of this, Henry? There you go. This is a new pot. I haven't written on paper. It's at least like a kid's writing. I peed in my pants. I gotta wash them so nobody finds out. Oh, I just saw a shadow. I think someone saw me. 
go what oh it's just a drawing oh no drawing a uh, shirt i mean that creeped me up for a second that hanging t-shirt i thought that was a person em emerging from the walls for a second Fucks all this. I think I can do anything with apparently. I always feel like black powder. Oh. A creepy. <laughs> Just someone walking around outside. A diary. I've been watching the surveillance rooms peephole the whole time. Sometimes he's there. Tell because I see a shadow move or he has footsteps. I'm guessing it's that thing up there they're talking about. What if we can't reach it? What in the Jesus am I looking at? Wait, why is that there? <laughs> why is that there? Oh. <laughs> Rip. The gig is up. But the gig was up. He knew. He knew what you were plotting, Mr. Dante. Can't get to that last one. Really nothing important is in is in there. They just take me back down. Why 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 all these ladders? <laughs> why would you bother going all the way around if you could just take these ladders from the beginning? I guess I don't know for cinematic purposes. <laughs> Who knows, maybe that's like a secret. Maybe it's just so you can get bothered, annoyed by the box. Oh my god, he came out of nowhere and sniped me. Isn't this the place where there's no light or something? No, this is a new spot. What? Oh, it looked like the wall was broken or something. Which is because of that, like where the camera was placed. No, I'm out of here. <laughs> I heard someone messing with keys in front of the door. Ain't no way. I'm out. I'm not fucking around. See, I'm just waiting to see if something happens. Graffiti here. I'm a boy genius and I figured out the answer to the surveillance room puzzle. It's light and water. Light and water? That clothes lying here. <laughs> oh, solid observation, Henry. <laughs> Diary. Had beef stew yesterday in the cafeteria. Heard there's a death chamber behind the kitchen, and they take meat straight from the dead people and cook it. That really scared me. Oh, just extra protein. I'm in trouble. I stood in front of the surveillance room and yelled as loud as I could, but nobody came. Mm 
Yo, what the fuck is that? Holy shit, what is that thing? <laughs> Monka, shake, get me out of here. That thing is creepy. I would love a hole right about now. Surely there's a hole up here, right? The ladder, go up and forget it, go down, go up. I need to regain some health here. It's another door with the symbol on it. To handle it. Oh no, I do not want to turn that just yet. Uh. What the near? Where? Where is it? now? I uh, now I'm in need of a hole. Where is the closest hole? Oh, yeah, right, 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 right. We came from down here. That's right. I'm in the holes right here. God, that thing looked fucking creepy. I think with like two masks or something, whatever it was. Absolutely horrifying. And at some point when we wake up, someone's going to be standing at the end of this bed here. <laughs> it's bound to happen. Is that a horse? What? No, it's a sign. Not a horse. Robbie. What do I have on me? Eh, nothing. Nothing crazy. We don't need to dump anything. Yeah, the TV's off. Oh. Who's he arguing with? Are they acting over who is gonna knock the on the door? Mm 
How long are they going to keep on arguing for? <laughs> I think they're just gonna keep at it all day. Well, anyway, so I'm gonna go hit hit through my hole once more. It sounds like a frock. <laughs> sounds like a voice, and then right after that, it sounds like a frock. Frock. It's a really strange frock. Um, <laughs> well, I guess we'll go up and explore the rest of that area where that creepy mask monster is. I think it was this floor. Yeah, seems like it. What in the? Why is that a hole in here? It's a hole. Jump in. <laughs> no, not yet. But there it is. <laughs> that thing is fucking horrifying, man. All the doors are open here? Wait, this one... Wait, is this just to get, like, across the rooms? What is this? Okay, now I'm curious. Hop in. Why is that two? Yeah, now I just take it to the other side. Wait, no, wait, where the fuck am I now? <laughs> I went down one floor. Oh, I'm in this room that was locked. Lock is broken, I can't open the door. Wait, but what the fuck, what am I doing in here? <laughs> Hop in the hole again. Oh, wait, is that the body shoot they were talking about or something? Maybe that's where the water shows up. Let me turn it on. I gotta go all the way back up again now. He's gonna kill me. I'm sure he is. I don't want to have it over the heel, just in case I accidentally use it. I don't want that. There's two of them? Man, those things are fucking creepy. But in the paper. Now it looks like I'm sleeping. Huh? Are those footsteps? I wonder if they saw me. I see. He made it look like it was him. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, that somehow worked. Another hole. Hmm. I want to check the last door before we hop in this hole. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, it's pretty terrifying looking, but its attack is pretty goofy. He just <laughs> tries to jump at me. Smack me over to his friend. Hey, I, wa I want this handgun ammo, even if it's gonna cost me my life. Pick up the fucking handgun ammo. How was I click no? Hey, get me the hell out of here. Alright, so let's try the. I think it's this way. Ow. You just say. Ah, uh, whatever. This this might actually take us to where the guy is. Who knows? Let's see. One more. Fuck. Wait, no, it's the one... Wait, is it the room over? Oh, he's in this room. Wait, is that where the... Oh, no, yeah, no, there's nothing there. Okay, Abel, we went through all the rooms, now... You know, we say it can't be too safe, so let's go save again and heal up. As we got... Smacked around like a basketball. We get smacked around like a basketball in those rooms, so... Back, regain our health and heal. Oh, I undumped the handgun that we just got. All this handgun ammo. Probably not even going to be able to carry all of it at the end if we don't use it. Is this guy still in the hall arguing, you think? Well, he's still there. What is he doing? He's just kind of standing there acting like a zombie. Oh, now he's gone. Hmm. Imagine. Then all of a sudden he's inside the apartment with me. Alright, so... Yeah, well I guess we'll go try and turn the valve. Overflow the whole building.
All the way to the top we go. I don't. I think I, don't, I, think I forgot to click on this door too. It's like it's from the inside. I think. Okay. Well, let's spin it. Spin that shit. See what happens. No. Did that do what I think it did? Did it fill up all those cells? Mm. I don't know why I didn't take the ladder. I wanted to see if maybe we forgot something here, but I don't think we did. Ah, uh, yeah, you can hear the water flowing. Wait. Wait, the, the water's flowing out of the walls. That, that's not where I... What? Oh, oops. Wrong room. Hey, how's it going? Ah, ah. Well, yes, yeah, see, I thought the water would be flowing through here. Maybe something happened on the other floors. I guess we'll go through all of them. Because yeah, there were some places where there were pipes on the ground. The box is still here? What the? Oh wait, maybe the water got rid of all those flower things in here. Oh, you can actually fight them. You can actually get rid of them. Well, then there's probably something in the door. And if there's anything, I could fight back. Like get rid of them. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Are you fucking serious? Wow. The fucking jabast. They put all those like flower wormy enemies in front of the door. To make you think there's something in here like it's protecting something. It turns out there was absolutely nothing. That was fucking lucky. Oh, it's much faster to jump through the hole, so I might as well do that. This is not the right room. I, I went past it. Wait, 
where the hell is the room? <laughs> Wait, it's this room. Oh, but I can't enter through. Oh my god, okay, we're just gonna have to take the peasant way down, I guess. Wait, but there's also no... Wait, what the fuck is happening? <laughs> they came back? <laughs> but yeah, there's no water coming out of this one. Right, whatever, I'm out of here. I'm, I'm gonna go check the other floor. Surely the water did something significant somewhere. Oh, sounds like it's raining down a storm in here. Check the bottom floor, see if something happened there. There's still this door. And this is the door I was thinking of, but yeah, this one's open already, right? Of course. Oh, it's okay. It's, it's raining down a storm here, too. Executed. I don't think it stepped on the other one, Bodo. How did, he, how did he miss that one? Alright, so we got this shit spinning now. Who knows what that means? <laughs> wasn't, wasn't there a sign somewhere? Oh, it's right there. I completely forgot about this. To turn on the lights in the third floor cells. Turn this water wheel. Remember that the water must flow in the direction of the water wheel. Of course, you also have to open the loose gate on the roof. Oh, wait, I never looked at that. But, there, but are, we already... We already did all that. But I guess maybe I have to move it over here now. Hold on, what did it say again? Turn on the light in the third floor cells. Turn this water wheel. Remember that the water must flow in the direction of the water wheel. It's doing that right now. And what light? All, all the lights already been on. Yeah, 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 all the lights been on there. The transformer is working.
can't open it very wide. Let's return now. So I don't know who knows. Maybe something happened. And it happens in our room now. After we turned all that on. I don't know if we can spin the water wheel. I don't know where we would turn it. Right, let's see if something happens here now. Hmm. No phone call. No radio. No one knocking on my door. <laughs> Gotta communicate to them with Morse code. Morse code for... Bonking on the window. Jeez, she's fighting more flies still. Wait, if she's there, does that mean maybe we can get Robbie to work? Probably not. Robbie, do the thing. Do your thing. P point at me. I don't think he's gonna do it. He's too shy. He's he's a bit camera shy right now. <laughs> yeah. All right, one last attempt. Yeah, no, he's he's camera shy right now. Kind of make a scene and remote and stuff like that. I think it happens when I press the remote control. Hmm. Why are those two always there in the window? They have never not been there. Let's see, do we have, we don't really have like anything. I have the coins and these placards, but I kind of doubt that we have to use that right now. There's a surveillance room in the middle of this complex. You have to use the corpse disposable shuts in the cells. I have one. The first and second floors, the cells are locked. It's not the kid. Oh, that's so the kids wouldn't discover them. You have to get to the first floor from one of the cells in the first floor. You know how to do it, but it's certainly a pain. The lights only work on the first floor. You have to get to the first floor. One of the cells on the first floor. Oh, okay. Well, in that case, it's probably the 
the only one I hadn't gone hasn't haven't gone through yet. We went through all of them except one, I think. Yeah, well then it's probably that. Let's try. Please, all the way from the bottom to the top. Here we go. Here we go, here we go. Thank God for the lab. Is that here? Followed me all the way down here. Oh, wait, fucking it's still following me. I went one up too high. So I went in... Wait, which one did I not go in? Ah, this one. The very first one on the left. Oh. Juked. Oh yeah, now the lights work too. Mm -hmm. So if this is not it, it might be one of the other ones. But the lights were off before. And now here we go. This looks... Oh, it looked a bit different. Camera angle was different before I started moving. Why is that body shoot in the cell? And at this sign. Right, here we go. Something new. Shower room. Who wants to shower? Uh, These guys apparently. It's unlocked. Oh. Unlocked. So does that take me back into here? Oh, it takes me here. Meat hooks next to the shower. And here we got all the peoples. The document here. <clears throat> this place continues to deteriorate. The doors, the doors to a number of cells are no longer open. As a result, the kids inside can no longer go outside. But the less they know about that, the better. Can't open the doors, but from this room I can watch them get more and more emaciated each day. No food and never showering themselves, they turn into smelly little grey lumps in there. Following the suggestion of an engineer, we've disposed of the corpse by digging a hole below the cells. To each floor of this building can be rotated independently. We can dispose of the bodies without, without dealers noticing by planting each cell with a body in it vertically. P.S. Chief. I bet you're just dying to see the interrogation room behind the kitchen. Says your feelings, but but have you noticed? <clears throat> there are three rooms with bloody beds. <clears throat> one is on the first floor, one is on the second floor, and one is on the third floor. If you line those three rooms up, 
There's bingo. I see. But also, what a fucked up place this is. <laughs> they had imprisoned kids? Pretty messed up. Very messed up, bro. Alright, give me a second. I wanna open my water here. How convenient this whole building rotates. Can I peep into the guy's room? Which room is he in? He's in this one. So much peeping in this game. Truly really is peepers the game. Little lumps. Is that what the worms are supposed to symbolize, I guess, maybe? Can I use the ladder, please? Thank you. I don't know where the bloody bets are. I guess we we're gonna have to go for each room again. There's a document here. Keep a close eye on the kids. It's important to keep the cells well lit. What's on the third floor were originally bored as searchlights. As a precaution against a blackout, they were set up to run a private generator. There's a hydraulic generator in the basement. To light up the la light up the first and second floors, use the corpse disposal chutes. What? So each floor of this building can be rotated. You can light up, light up any of the cells by matching up the holes. I think this periodically is an effective way to keep the kids fearful and well-behaved. P.S. Chief, if you turn the handle in the middle of this room, you can easily rotate the cells. You can't rotate the first floor. So align the second and first floor with the first floor cells. That has bloody stained bed. By the way, if you use the peephole in this room, it's easy, it's easy to make sure you're doing it right. Give it a try. Just please don't forget to open the slush, slush gate on the roof. Much appreciated, Chief. I see. Well, I gotta go down again and look for the bloody bed. How would I go? Oh, yeah, because I can't. Yeah, I can't turn the one where he is, so. Yeah, because I, I was thinking we were going to have to turn his floor to an open door, but no, his floor doesn't turn. All we can do is a bloody bed thing, but let's go up again for now. See. I've got a memo. Secret number for getting through the door in in the back of the kitchen. This one for 0302. Thank you for your cooperation. How many numbers in this game? Write that one down too. 0302. Alright, well, let's go all the way down and see where this bloody bed is. Hey. I'm gonna be honest, I haven't even noticed a bloody bed in any of the rooms we went in. I guess that could be in one of the blocked ones, too. Let's see. Oh, well, I guess it's that one right there. That looks pretty bloody to me. So that's that one, okay. Yeah, like the one on the left side of the desk. Okay, okay. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. The one with all the powder. Is that a bloody bed? That looks more like a bloody floor. Same with that. That too. Oh, there it is. Okay. 
So it's right there. We gotta get we gotta get it over there, so one, two, three, four. Spin it four times clockwise. One. Two. Three. And four. How would you do this without the person who's noticing? Without them noticing? It's so fucking loud, the whole building's turning. Alright, so if we did that correctly, it should be here now. It's not. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, wait, no, that's the wrong one. It, it's this one. Ah, yeah, okay, so we, we did do it correctly. Okay, so last one. Well, from accounting, eh? Hey. Jimmy's in the chat room. What's up, Jimmy? How are we doing tonight? How did how did this how did the, the stream go, Jimmy? <laughs> Yo, that's creepy. <laughs> you can just see them chilling on the walls. I could tell you indeed. But are you finished Lego City? Nice. A pretty long game. Pretty long Lego game. <laughs> no more cheesy jokes, and then you come here. Oh no. If anything, you're gonna get even more. Where is the bloody bed? There it is. They do, yeah. <laughs> they all do. Okay, so we just gotta turn this twice clockwise. One... Oh, wait, no, I did it already? Oh, okay, sure, I guess. Wait, what the fuck? Wait, how did they already do it? No. That can't be right. Why is it open? <laughs> huh? <laughs> well, I hope he got out, because I'm about to spin this again. Six hundred K Scooby Sips. He's closing into a million. And then he'll be among the millionaires here. Among the Scooby Sip millionaires. Fuck I need to go up again. Alright, so assuming that was right and that guy's out now, we cool. I don't know why it opened for him. But I guess we're gonna go find out. He's still saving up for that 10 mil. For that certain Ubisoft racing game. Don't make me feel sad anymore. I still feel like you want me to stop. I just stay inside. Let me stay in there. Please. Come on, you let me out of here. I'm signing you. I'm tired of dying here. Just let me stay in there, won't Wait, is the kid's name Walter? Who is that boy? And who are you? His name's Walter. Walter 
Sullivan. I what? used to work at the orphanage. The kid has been murdering all these people? I'm Andrew DeSalvo. They tried to make it seem like an orphanage, but according to that town's holy scriptures, it was actually the center of their religion. And that kid Walter. He was really into that mumbo jumbo. Especially that descent of the Holy Mother business. It was scary. Oh God. Oh. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. What the hell? Although I can't unsee it, but I can't unsee it, but the guy that we're playing as, I don't know why, but he looks like a young Tom Cruise or something. <laughs> the guy that we're playing as, I don't know why he looks like Tom Cruise to me. Wait, isn't that the floor I want to be on, is it? You've been streaming like crazy lately. Mad man. Right, let's head home and save. Done all the progress. So that's, that sounds fun. I hope, I hope it was a fun Minecraft session. Me too, had. You really enjoy him? I believe it. They can make you do nine hour long streams. That would... It's mean you really like him. Wait, what? Huh? That that's that's so random. What? Excuse me, Mr. Junior? What happened? You might have to buy more Lego games. You don't have- I thought you had them all. I thought you had them all already. No, she's still out there fighting the air. That means we can go look at Robbie. Buy more. How many is there? Un well, yeah. PS4, I guess. Oh, three even. Yeah, how many is there in total? Hey, they finally moved from up there. It's the, only the girl now. Uh... I don't need to pick anything up. Okay, yeah, let's go back and see what happens. Yeah, I hope you'll be able to get that to work. Hopefully the video has helped. Oh yeah, I guess we're gonna go to the interrogation room. They said that was near the kitchen or something. What the hell is the kitchen in this place? Hmm. 
Is it the the thing? The giant door at the bottom, maybe? Yeah, that sounds like a good idea, Gov. Day off to see if you can get it to work. Hmm. The hand oil. Let's deal with the note. About it. Only the suggestion. Dying to see the interrogation room behind the kitchen. Understand your feelings, but have you noticed? Three. Yeah, the kitchen. I don't know what that is. We don't, we don't know of any kitchen. You can pretty easily make that last till the end of the month. Yeah, let's go check that gi the giant door at the bottom. If you decide to 100% some of them on the way, then now you could easily do it. Let's see. Did anything happen with this giant door now? Doesn't seem like it. Maybe we have to go in one of the rooms with the bloody bits. Unless they're misaligned. And they, they shouldn't be misaligned. I'm pretty sure I did it correctly. I see. Well, then you could always add those in case you run out. In case you finish your current Lego games too fast. No, that's, that's the wrong way. Nothing else in that shower room. Oh, is it just this door here that works now? No. What's up, guys? Making sure I didn't miss anything in here. Stop hitting Tom Cruise. That's a pretty lengthy game. Hopefully that'll end up taking a couple of days for you. I guess it depends on how immersed into them that you get. Oh, oh, wait, I, I see. I get it now, so... Yeah, since we lined up all the bloody bets, we should just be able to hop through all of them and then that should take us to the kitchen, I'm guessing. Yeah, 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 it should, because from that other note they said they take meat from the kitchen. Since there was like an infirmary or whatever next to it. Oh, yeah, right, right, right. So, assuming they're all lined up correctly, we should be able to hop through them. Which, yeah, they should, because that's there, that's there. That, that. That, yeah, yeah, they should all be lined up correctly. I'm not confident. But can I enter the room? Yeah, I can enter. The, yeah, okay, we should be fine. Yeah. And there you go. That's an easy fix to it. Yeah. 
cut the cut the streams in half. And then if you really want to keep going, you could do Minecraft for the other half. Here we here I go again, hopping through holes, as you do. There's nothing there. That really looks like something. I guess not. Get into the games. <laughs> yeah, you get real into these Lego games. Man completely loses track of time. Ends up playing it for nine hours. Oh, that really looks like a key. Oh, wow. Yes, it is. And it's played on the door. Oh fuck! No, I shouldn't have removed this yet. Watchfulness. Okay, no, it's fine. Dining hall. Oh, wait, wait, there's a ladder in here? What? Uh, actually, I think that's a ladder for the outside. Yeah, it's a ladder for the outside. It's not for in here. <laughs> See, that's true. When, when you really enjoy a game, you end up playing it for long, really long periods of time. That, that's just what that gob does. What was the code? Zero. Three. Zero. Two. And just like that, we've walked into a soul movie. What the hell? What have you gotten yourself into, Tom Cruise? He's fucking dead. He's the 18th victim. They <laughs> killed Tom Cruise's brother. <laughs> John Cruz, no. Anyone but John Cruz. Well, oh. on Tom Cruise now. Wicky wicky sleepy head. Rise and shine. We've got more killing to do. Did the time of day change? Ok, 
kind of. It's like the sun's about to go down. I was, oh my god. <laughs> yeah, possible ADHD. Yeah, you just hyper focus on the game. <laughs> hyper focus on it. Track everything else. <laughs> I don't know why, but I still find it so funny you can knock on the window. Like, help me! Get me out! I'm trapped in my apartment! Get me out of here! Jesus! Who left the water running? Yo, someone slipped us a new note. I found something that's extremely effective against the ghost. It saved my life. It was stuck into the huge rock in the woods near the orphanage. It's a saw blade with a handmade triangle shaped wooden handle that has some kind of spell written on it. As a weapon, it's heavy and hard to carry, but somehow it seemed to change in response to the ghost's victim's power. Right when the sword is energized, if you don't reduce the, that power, your attacks will be re repelled. As far as I know, there are only five swords in existence. With that kind of power, it's extremely valuable. Wait, 24. Thank you, mysterious person who's slipping me these notes under the door. Okay, a bag accuring in the hall. There's no news report about this guy dying. There was a news report with these two other people, but not this guy. Maybe they haven't found his body yet, I guess. Who's taking a shower? In my bathroom. What's going on? Oh. <laughs> What's happening? Is she watching TV? She's still watching TV. With how much she's laughing, she's probably watching the stream. This comedian stream. Laughing at all the jokes. Because everyone's a comedian here. All right, well, let's go see who's taking a shower. Someone took a shower with blood. Blood. It's stained with blood. That's horrible. It's like that water-filled room under the central prison. Oh. There's no water coming out at all. The hole's even bigger now. There's a lot of noise coming from the inside of the hole. Let you go in. Hit first.
Where in the world are we now? Back under the subway? What the hell is happening? What's a car doing here? What the fuck is going on? Someone trying to shoot a squeak toy? What is happening? What the fuck is that thing? Yes, I'm Tom Cruise. Don't shoot me. Hey, you're the guy that lives across from me. Yeah, my name's Henry. I'm Richard Braintree, from 207. What the hell's happened to us? That hold in this freaky world. But if you're here too... Something wrong with the whole apartment building. That must explain what happened to that other guy, too. What other guy? The guy who lived in 302 before you. A journalist. He disappeared one day. He got pretty crazy towards the end. Shut himself up in his room and wouldn't come out. Anyway, I'm getting the hell out of here. You should too, if you know what's good for you. Wait. Watch out for that kid. Huh. <laughs> Whatever you say, Tom Cruise. Ah, you missed. This is the guy that was yelling in the hallway. <laughs> He's trying to block it! <laughs> did I do a very poor job at that time? That was weird. I thought the game crashed for a second. What's happening? Oh my god, this sound. The spider's web. Who's trying to deep throat something? What is happening here? Oh, you zoned out. Well, welcome back. Oh, he's dying. Welcome back to the real world instead of gov. None of the books in this bookshelf look particularly interesting. There's a weird sword stuck in his stomach and he's holding something in his hand. Got the ghost key. Key the ghost was holding. Can I have this? There's a sword stuck in his stomach. Pick it out. Got the sword of obedience. Jimmy Rest sword. When used against a downed ghost, it stops them in a place. You pull it out, the ghost is revived. <laughs> well, I wish I had that knowledge before I pulled it out of him. I'll see you. That's a lot. That's a lot of hours just in two days, Mr. Gov. Starting off strong with your Lego month. Oh, it doesn't. This is. There's no floor next to me. What the fuck is that? What 
the hell is happening? Oh, hey, man. What the hell? Something reeks. Sorry, that that that's probably me. I haven't I haven't shouted in over a month. My, my, my bad. My bad, Tom Cruise. You struggled to do two hours. Yeah. Well, that completely got turned upside down now. Now you're back to old gov. Doing nine hours every day. What in good shop. Oh, there's a hole here. Shaft is about to fall apart. There's nothing interesting in it, though. An aluminum bat. Oh, this bat is made out of plastic. It's totally useless as a weapon. An aluminum bat. Take the aluminum bat. Get the aluminum bat. Yeah, it's only powerful and easy to use as a weapon. Also, this sword is not a weapon. This is a key item. Surely the bat won't break, right? So sort of woolly balls. All sorts of sports supplies, but not thing particularly interesting. Yo, it's another golf club, golf bag, but nothing inside. A five iron. Wait, what was the other one I got? Was that a six iron? Either way, I'm going through my hole again. Man is saying Knack is wholesome. <clears throat> Man is saying Knack 2 is wholesome. I don't think it's the same Knack we're talking about then. <laughs> There's so much death and destruction in that. So much innocent murdering. So much innocent goblin killing. It's a kid's game at least. Oof, no, I, I wouldn't say that. I want to see a kid beat that game then. And very hard. On their first playthrough. Hey, you guys. Just him either. There's uh, something wrong with this whole apartment. Don't say that. They're scaring me. <laughs> yeah, but another hand get added to the wall. Another victim. What? Lately it's started to smell terrible. Huh? Umbilical cord? Oh. Well, I forget I said anything. <laughs> what? Noise. 
Guy keeps an umbilical cord in his room. I'm starting to smell bad. Well, yeah, it sure do wonder why it's starting to smell bad. Oh, yeah, the note. Grabber appears stuck in here. It's stained with blood and I can't read it. What? Why is it stained with blood? He just slipped it under the door. What happened? Put the pen. Put Nintendo's memo into your scrapbook. I really can't read it. Hey, you chalk with the raid. Appreciate the raid, my good sir. How was the stream? What were you playing? Oh, that blur. <laughs> Hello, that blur. And goodbye, blur. <laughs> Have a good one. These sideline hill games, man, they, they really push it to the limit. They really something else. <laughs> I don't think he's going to do the thing. Yeah, no, he's not, he's not doing the thing. And now the news. In Washington, a gathering of 200,000 people appealing for stricter gun control laws... Wait, we already had this. ...the state of violent shootings throughout the country turned tragic when shots were fired into the crowd. Two people were killed and several wounded, including a three-year-old child. At this moment, no suspects have been found. Police are investigating the source of the shots. Yeah, that's a that fucked up news report. We read that earlier. <clears throat> hey, you, and then he puts that emote. Jesus Christ. Stop that. Stop it, Mr. Gov. Uh... Hmm. Well, I have the sword on me. Oh, you're yeah, right. We have bullets and the, the golf club. Yeah, I guess I don't need the pipe anymore. Now we've got the bat. What? Oh my god. <laughs> what are you implying with that emote, my good sir? Rename? What, what, what does that even do? <laughs> what, what does that even do? I don't even know what that's for. Turn from building world. <clears throat> oh, it's a stream element watch thing. I see. Yeah, no, we don't. We don't do that around here. We don't do watch times around these parts. Oh, this is what we do instead. Yes, sir. I'm looking for Llewellyn Moss. Did you go up to his trailer? Yes, I did. Well, I'd say he's at work. Do you want to leave a message? Where does he work? I can't say. Where does he work? Sir, and then there's I all the crying in the background. No about our residence. Where does he work? Did you not hear me? We can't give out no information. Where does he work? Sir. Where does he work? I can't say. What the hell is this? <laughs> Do you 
want to leave a message? Where does it work? Sir, you may have does it work? work? He's gonna go through the hole now. He's gonna check the hole to see if he's there. He's looking at a hole in the bathroom. That yeah, kind of fits. With the crying in the background on the hole. <laughs> Where does he work? Where does Tom Cruise work? Wait, <laughs> was this the entrance to the Yakuza Club? Oh, that from the Yellow's Judgment. <laughs> the entrance to the Poker Club. You gotta enter through. You gotta enter through the bathroom. <laughs> right, right. Now nah, this doesn't take you to a Poker Club, unfortunately. This takes you to a sports store. A sports and goods store. Uh, no fancy Poker Club this time. I'm sorry. Only a place where you can buy bats and golf clubs and other sports things. There's blood everywhere. Oh my god. Who just woke up the lion? Oh my god. I thought that was from the game for a second. <laughs> you have blood in your shoe. So I do. I have blood on my walls this time. Is this a zoo? Sure sounds like it, right? You just hurt the lion and everything? What the fuck? Oh, that's the demon dog of hell. Yeah, that, that went pretty smooth. Why am I? Did I just walk in a circle? No, I didn't. Excuse me. Thank you. <laughs> what the hell? I know, right? The enemies are so goofy in this one. They're not really that much of a danger. Why is the room upside down now? <laughs> Don't worry, me. <laughs> I'm running towards him, pushing him back. Okay, where are we, good sir? I just need to get to this door. Hey, they're, they're not really that harmful in this. An upside down clock. The hands aren't moving. The doorknob is rusted shut and I can't get it open. Oh, well, I guess we're not supposed to be here yet. Is he here again? He is. Hold on. Tump Cruise coming through. Hello. How many, is there any other doors in this room? That's a death trap. Uh, oh. Wait, what is that? enough cat food for an army of cats. Found keys, we take them. You got Albert's sports keys. Oh. It's enough cat food to feed a cat army. Let me in.
Oh, but yeah, I just completely forgot something. I forgot to upload a new emote earlier. I don't know if I can do it right now. <laughs> I wanted to upload a new Silent Hill emote. Yeah, well, I gotta do that tomorrow then. Use me. Excuse me, gentlemen. Tom Cruise has places to be. Where the hell am I going? <laughs> Wait, this is an elevator? God scene. Look at Tom Cruise. Doesn't he look like Tom Cruise? No. Kid, you was talking about. You live in that apartment too, huh? Say, you look a lot like a little punk that I once caught sneaking around there. Do you know something about what's going on? Hey, hey, you! Stop! Punk shake. <laughs> Threatening the kid with a gun. Where am I now? I'm in basement 12. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> How deep underground am I? Why do you have 12 basements? Where is this going to take me? This place is a fucking maze. <laughs> but where am I now? Doors are locked from the inside. Wait, what? There's a door here. There it is. Like this hanger that I'm on the other side. What the fuck was that? See where the other ladder takes me in here. Does that take me where the handgun ammo is? Oh. Takes me up. 
absolutely nowhere. How much health do we have? Half everything. We should hopefully be fine till the next hole. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Is he bleeding? Nah, no, I don't think it's bleed effect. The thing that killed- oh my god. The thing that kills in the beginning was the- was the, the headache. <laughs> that don't mind me. I see you're blocking the door there, sure, but please, don't mind me. I just, I just need to go through really quick. I have two heals on me, but yeah. Preferably if it can be avoided, I don't want to use them. Holy shit. Yeah, this place is so confusing. How... How am I going to remember everything else and where I'm supposed to be? I feel like we've been here already, haven't we? Or is this actually like a new area? Yeah, this is like a new area. Just garbage. There's nothing useful here. Creates nothing interesting about that. An axe? It's a rusty axe. Take the rusty axe. Those should be powerful and easy to handle. Oh, there's a hole! I want to read this note first, though. The boss said that the numbers this time is the last four digits of his draw's phone number. But the phone number is written, is written right there on the sign on the roof. Anybody could see it from south. Yeah, yeah. Is that really okay? Oh wait, I know what that is. The code is three seven five zero. Let me look around the room some more. Uh, should we go save? Yeah, we should. Not even go save, but just go back and regain health. Yeah, the code is 375. Just, I still have it written down from the beginning of the stream. When we looked at this logo, at the sign, and, and then we tried to call it. Someone's knocking on your door chat. You hear that knocking? Someone wants your attention. Someone wants to go sell- someone wants to sell you something. At the door. No one's home, go away. No one's in here. What the fuck? Nah, if that isn't ominous at all. Better check on your neighbors soon. Ridden in blood. Okay. I'll, I'll give him a call. And check up on them. Make sure they still get enough milk. <laughs>
<laughs> Help me, I'm trapped in this tent. I do that every time. I gotta stop. <laughs> Help me, I'm stuck in this apartment. Get me out of here. <laughs> Let's check up on her, shall we? She's just chilling here. Nothing to check up on. Is, is Robbie gonna murder her? As he's watching TV. Hmm? Not, nothing out of the ordinary. <laughs> How much ammo? We have. I have a five iron and a six iron golf club. Hey, anybody want to go golfing? I have forty rounds. Oh, it's sta so it stacks in the inventory, but it doesn't stack in. Oh, it's st it stacks in the item box and not in your inventory. Okay. I will hold on. All down, because I gotta go piss really quick, so. Be a be gentleman. Hey, I, I have returned. Get back to it, shall we? Yep, 
Let's head in and unlock this thing. I didn't realize how late it already is. <laughs> it's already three in the morning. Time's been flying. And we've been playing these Silent Hill games. Um, what the fuck? <laughs> Why is that worm on the, on, the, on the wall? It's a billiard table. Looks like they were in the middle of a game. So, three seven fifty. Nice. Jesus Christ, what now? Is that our neighbor? Bro. Can't catch me. Tom Cruise is too fast. What's this? It's your 207 from my apartment building. There's a plate on the door. Okay, it's plate. It has an abstract picture and says cares. Well, someone's gonna die. Oh shit. Save him, Tom Cruise. 19121. Another victim. One more for the kill count. Those subtitles, though. Wait, what? The one 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 two one man? Wait, who is that? Isn't that the one for the co from the coffin? Yeah, I think that's the one from the coffin. Wait, so he never died? What? He faked he pretended to murder himself? He faked his own death? Because I think one 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 two one. I believe that's the one. For, that was the one from the coffin. There's a man in two seven pointing his finger. Pointing at the room three hundred three, Elaine's room. 
Oh. Is she next? Happy, why are you pointing at <laughs> I'm doing it again. <laughs> Looks like another one, Captain. Got one, one, two, one on his head. It's just like that case from 10 years ago. Yeah, that Walter Sullivan case. But Sullivan's dead. They even got the body. Oh. Must be some crazy copycat. Yeah, but even so, So he did fake his own death or something? Oh shit. Uh, well, let me do... Let me, s let me do make a save before we do anything drastic. Or do anything else. You got out of that world so quick. I'm really surprised by that. Thank God, though, because that place was confusing as all hell. This guy's back here, but yeah, that, that's another victim. Another one for the kill count. Another hand added to, added to the wall now. Which is about to go out and party. Robbie, do something. Stop her. I guess yeah, she's gonna be at the peephole now. Peephole, oh, the the peep, yeah, the peephole in the door. Did we miss her? Oh, she's sleeping now. He's still sleeping. <laughs> well, her sleeping, does that mean she's... We can go find her? Through the hole in the bathroom? Robbie's still just chilling. Put this in here together with all the other ones. No sound now. No blood in my b b my shower. This hole, it's not like a human made it. Getting even bigger and rounder. I think I've seen this pattern before. 
Is it just gonna take me back to the apartments? Or like the, the buildings too? Is it gonna take me to her dream? Real free. It's the murder man. The night man. That's what it is, Tom Cruise. Says I came home movie. <laughs> it is certainly a game. A good old classic PS2 game. You're a little scared. Just the way that it should be. With these Silent Hill games. Pretty scary. Pretty terrifying. They got some solid sound design. Really creepy music and everything. And the environment too. Well, it looks like all those... <laughs> what? Well, look at all these porno magazines. <laughs> Why did they put that here? What the fuck? Okay. All right. A diary here. What the hell is that, new Ellie? Welcome. Welcome, yeah, to this creepy Silent Hill game. He sent you over here. Well, what a nice guy. What a gentleman. What a nice gent. Sending you over here. To the comedian stream, to the sitcom of a stream. The last few months, Joseph, the guy next door to me who gave me that rap porno <laughs> magazine, <laughs> looks like he's been working super hot. He said if he found another rap one, he'd give it to me, but he hasn't shown his face around much lately. Yo, dude, he gave me that super rap porno mag. Who, who the fuck is this? Is this Date? From AI? Said he was a journalist and he always in, and he's always investigating stuff, but I think something strange is going on with him. He's been shut in his apartment and I can't and I can hear all these weird noises coming from there. July first, Mike. Oh my beautiful Rachel. What's with the note on the red paper? I thought you'd written the note back to me. I guess maybe it was somewhere else. I took it along with my clothes. Those were my best clothes. July second, Mike. Don't mind if I join. It's all good. You're more than welcome. More than welcome to join the budget Discord too. Always looking for more Sue employees. You put Mike's diary in your scrapbook. It's a red piece of paper with nothing written on it. Uh, sure. Stick it on the room 302's door. Why is it? It's telling me what to do. Yep, note, note, it, noted it down. Essentially, what Tom Cruise does. He notes down everything he finds. What the fuck is this? Oh, this is supposed to be the shower. Game back seating. Yeah, and even even in this these old PS2 games, what is this? 
I thought these were, I thought these were supposed to be hard and not give you any direction whatsoever. But yeah, it literally tells me in the description of the item, like, oh, I'll stick this, I'll, I'll stick it on the room 302's doll. Like, oh, okay. Well, thanks for just straight up telling me what to do, I guess. This guy. Is that the super? He's much younger in this picture. There's a key taped on the back of it. It says 105 on it. Wow, it showed you wonder what dorm was supposed to use that on. It's a photo of a nurse. It says I love you on it. It's a key taped on the back of it. Who's the nurse? Lisa? I don't think it's Lisa. Porno magazines everywhere. <laughs> Back the You should be like, huh? For like 40 hours straight. <laughs> trying to figure out what to do. Just pacing back and forth in, in the room. Trying to figure out what to do. And little do you know that was just the tutorial. That was just the, the tutorial. How the game begins for real. Yeah, we need more of that. Instead of just like, hey, this is what you should do. Go do it. Hey, this is how you solve the puzzle. AKA every PlayStation game ever. Is there time for that right now? No. It's a magazine lying open. Teaching the spare wish house. Wish house. An orphanage on the outskirts of Silent Hill. But behind its walls of image is a place where children are kidnapped and brainwashed. Wish house is managed by the Silent Hill Smile Support Society. Charity organization sometimes called 4S. The 4S is a well-respected charity that takes in poor children without homes and raises them with hope. But it's hard. It is a heathen organization that teaches its own warped dogma. In layer of a of good religious values. Mr. Smith, Temp, who lives near Rich House, had this to say. Oh, sometimes at night I can hear their weird prayers and the sound of children crying. I went there to complain one time, but they ran out at, but they ran me out. Ran me right out. Since then it hadn't changed a bit. In fact, this reporter was was refused admission when he attempted to take photographs in the facility. What exactly do the folks at Rich House have to hide? Doing my investigations, I was able to discover, however, a suspicious looking around concrete tower which appears to be part of their facilities. Fortunately, no one was willing to tell us what the tower was useful, but it seems unlikely that it has anything to do with the business of raising orphanage. It may in fact be a prison, or a secret place of worship. The cult religion that operates Rich House is known by the locals simply as the Order. It's a religion that is deeply interwoven with, with the wound with Silent Hill's history. Its worshippers Farrant Farrant belief that they are among the elite, chosen people, as a dark and dangerous side. I intend to continue my investigation of Wish House and the cult behind it. I always believe that telling the whole truth and showing the children the true path is our most important duty. Because this note was also in the previous game. In free. Where's my hole? There it is. Do you? I want to go save because you picked up so many things. Hey, nice Discord. Thank you. I'm glad you like the Discord. I'm glad you're liking the budget, Sue. The budget Discord, Sue, and Discord. Budget Discord, Sue, and Discord. Indeed. The budget zoo feels clashy, man. Yep. The budget zoo where everyone dresses like gentlemen. Everyone dresses really fancy. That's the budget zoo right there. Budget gentlemen. Wait, that's... 
That's the washing machine. Someone slipped me a new note. There's a red paper stuck in here. I figured out the riddle behind the numbers. 01121 is actually... What is that? 21st of January? In other words, oh, one out of 21. So Walter was planning on killing 21 people. We never finished the job. What a scrub. He was convicted for the murders of Billy and Marie Milokin, the seventh and eighth victims. After which he committed suicide in his jail cell. The grisly mass murder of 10 people shocked the world and came to be known as the Walter Sullivan case. The two big puzzles here. First is, what was the motive for the murders? Second is, why did he kill himself before completing his task? Was he simply insane? Well, you just said he killed himself in prison, right? So... I mean, he already got caught at that point. Might as well add himself to his own counter, I guess. Is that what he was thinking? I don't know. What do I look like? A murderer? Do I look like a serial killer? Why, why are you asking me these questions? May 2nd. Arguing again. Wait, so. Oh, that means we're almost done. There's only two more victims left. The last one was the 19th, so there's only two more. So, what a nice and secure lock for your door. Must be a pain in the ass to unlock, though. When you, when the pizza guy shows up, oh, yeah, hold on a second, delivery man. And he just he then he just hears all these chains from the other side of the door, being unlocked and dragged away. I wonder what the pizza guy was feeling. Right, but let's save before we check on the washing room. Bow. Turn from a pop world. And on a lighter note, we have a new addition to the zoo. Last night at 3 a.m., a female baby tiger was born, and both mother and child are reportedly doing just fine. All some news. For once. <laughs> Let me out of here. Let me out of this damn apartment. They haven't had pizza in over five days. I need, I need some pizza. <laughs> What's our neighbor up to? Looks like Luke. It looks like Eileen is okay. Who turned my washing machine on? Who in the chat room turned on my washing machine? Oh. <laughs> uh. Whoops. The second time this week, I accidentally left the body inside the the dryer. God damn it. The tank foiled with oil. You don't have anything to say about the blood? What the hell is this? The dryer sprayed blood all over the place. Not again. The second time this week.
Uh, well, right? We have so... We have the note and we have two keys. I can do the porno mag apartment we go. Um what else is here? Oh, you're giving me a headache. Oh. I don't think there's anything anything else in here. Oh no. Wait, that was the kid. Oh, he was, it was just an illusion. I think it's like from the other side. Is this the one where I have to slip the note? Yeah. Hey, here you go, man. Put the red paper in the door crack. Wait, so is, wait, is it himself that's writing the notes to himself? And slipping the notes under his own door? Isn't this where we live? Rio 2? This is... This is the same way they show up in the door. Wait, so is it himself that leaves himself notes? What it kind of looks like. What was that guy doing here? Could he be the next victim? Or could it be... I think she's the next victim, if anything. He's right there. That man. I got this from Miss Galvin. A long, long time ago. That a doll you're holding? She was younger than me back then. She looks so happy. Looks so uh, happy. Why did you take so long to continue your diet? Hand. Here. Thanks, man. You don't need anything for it. A wine bottle, perhaps? No? Shabby doll. You got the shabby doll. Old doll given by the man sitting on the apartment stairway. This is that guy that knocked on her door. I thought he would be the murderer. He is from Dura. Guess he's pretty friendly. Oh wow, it actually opens. garbage. There, there ain't nothing here, chief. Unless I missed it. 
Wait, what is that? It's part of some torn jeans. There's blood and some kind of animal hair on them. Oh, am I something interesting? Yeah, the, the demon dogs of hell are eating me. They're eating Tom Crows. I mean, I would love some pizza right about now. I'm almost, what, 4 a.m. pizza? Sounds pretty fucking good. Hey, man. Oh, my head. I'm seeing ghosts again. Is that blood on the walls? It sure is. Blood and flesh. Seems good, man. For your pizza. <laughs> I wouldn't mind that. I don't think there's any plays open right now, though. Yeah. I don't think too many places are open at this hour. It's mostly deep within the city that the, the, the uh, pizza place is open. Just late or early. These are the tenants' lockers. There are numbers. 101 through 304. No, I don't know, man. It's mostly those like big brand pizza places that are open at this hour, I'm pretty sure. I don't trust them. <laughs> I don't trust those big brand pizzas like Domino's. We do, we do have Domino's here, but I don't trust them. I'd rather get it from my local pizzeria. <laughs> the gov play this, he'll be a little pussy. <laughs> Hey man, yeah, yeah, we've talked about that actually. Yeah, I would, I would love to see him play this. I'd love to see him play Silent Hill or just, just any old PS2 horror game. I would love to see him play that kind of game. See how he likes it. My blood. Should we hit? Should we hit a blood? Ow. What did we have the key for? 105, 106. Ah. Ah. Oh, he missed. Ah, they're all on the other side. Excuse me. Mm, yeah, we should. Yeah, might as well. There is a hole here, so I might as well head back and, and regain health. I like how in the beginning I said this was going to be the hottest Silent Hill of them all, but. I think I was very wrong about that. <laughs> it's just that didn't age really well. Cause we've been here for almost six hours and well so far i'd say this might be one of the easiest because there's so many like places like so many holes here that you can t travel back to your apartment and traveling back to your apartment just it's basically just a free heal because yeah it fully heals you up as you can see in the top left and most of the enemies are pretty harmless to be honest they don't really hit you they're pretty easy to avoid Except from the doggos. Kind of the only ones that are a little bit difficult to dodge. And they do a good chunk of damage too. But, I mean, you never know. I'm, they're remaking the second game of this. They're remaking the second Silent Hill, so... You never know when that comes out. 
Maybe maybe the gov he'll play it. Maybe Hobbs will play that. Whenever that comes out. If it's ever coming out. If it's not just a scam. <laughs> Konami announces it and then it never comes out. Seems like a Konami thing. Oh yo, we got a new note. Wait, is this the note that I slipped to myself? It was four years ago that they discovered the body with 12, 20, 21. Oh, 12 out of 21. Cabbed into it. Right away, I had this terrible feeling. I couldn't stop it at shaking. The victim had been murdered six months earlier. But Walter had been dead for seven years. He had committed suicide three years before the murder. Police think it's a copycat crime. And are calling it the Sullivan case round two. Something about it is bothering me. Something about it bothered me. May 14th. You didn't write down the thing that bothered you? Come on, man. this guy <laughs> up what? <laughs> what a creep just walks up stands in front of a peephole stares into it for a little walks off alright you do you man you do you. Can't see her. I wonder if something happened to Eileen. Looks like Aline is okay. She's using the bathroom, I guess. Ugh. Well, let's head back. It's weird that there's no creepy sounds coming from the hole anymore. So that's just a creepy loading screen to because it. <laughs> it appears in a random spot every time. A floating ghost or whatever it is. <clears throat> Do you use the superintendent's key? Turned his kitchen into a prison, so. Why does he have a surveillance system? <clears throat> there are keys for each apartment here. Ooh. Now we're talking. Actually, it looks like 303 is missing. And that's mine, right? I keep forgetting which one's mine. I think ours is 303. It's a piece of red paper. I gotta slip. I gotta go slip this one to myself again. <laughs> Wait, there's another one. Okay. It's a hastily scribbled memo. Found by Nurse Rachel. Turned it to room 302 together with the pot. Her boyfriend, Mike? Tore it off. Fucking Mike, man. Not again.
The red box. Man, this thing really stinks. It's particularly bringing tears to my eyes. Oh, th that's probably why he has the umbilical cord. Guy said he was keeping an umbilical cord in a, in a box. Fucking disgusting. <laughs> Who would do that? If I didn't know this was a Silent Hill game, I would think Hideo Kojima directed this one. A diary. Red box seems even stranger today. It's giving off a terrible smell. Disgusting, but I just can't throw it away. It's been around 30 years ago that young couple was living in the apartment. One day they just suddenly disappeared. Ran off just like thieves in the night. I don't know why. Why has there been money trouble and maybe they got themselves into some kind of danger? Problem came after that. Left that newborn baby when they took off. I even found the umbilical cord. Called the ambulance right away and I heard the baby survived. But I don't know what happened to him. Although a few years later, I often saw a young kid hanging around the apartment. One day, he just stopped coming by. But now that I think of it, I bet that... I bet he was that abandoned baby. The Harbour story. Abandoning a newborn baby? That all happened in room 302. Oh, room. And the umbilical cord I found there, well... Still can't get myself to throw it away. Why is he keeping the umbilical cord? That... Very weird. <laughs> That's strange. He can't. He can't get himself to throw it away. Feels attached to it or something. I guess. He just feels the need to keep it. Hmm. Well, we can go for all the apartments now. Is that a bike? The frame of it? We can go for every single apartment now. Some very trippy wallpaper. People trip wallpaper. It says my darling's number. And there are some numbers that look like a phone number. We so press these numbers. That's a big cons Uh, mm. it's a nurse's uniform. The name on it says Rachel. Uh, like to go save. Yeah, <clears throat> the save right there too. So. I probably should have slipped myself those notes before I did this, but... What time are we coming up on here? Slowly creeping up on four. in the morning.
I don't think I can afford to dump anything, which is okay, to be honest. I mean, I could dump the handgun ammo. To be fair. Yeah. Honestly, at this point, I could even dump the handgun, because we don't use it. We're saving it. <laughs> yeah, there's no new note, because I forgot to give myself one. He's still just saying that. Well, let me guess. Are they arguing in the hall again? No, well, no, he's just walking by this time. I would gladly enter the hole. I don't know if I should pick up the mid bag actually. Well, maybe I should. Uh, yeah, maybe I should. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, we'll just pick it up. Pick it up and then we'll use the phone. Yeah, so, I mean, we'll get more inventory space here in a second. Pick up the phone, chat. Pick up the phone. It's a phone ringing somewhere. Oh. Excuse me. Oh, wait, is it like calling her in the real world now? Or is it, am I calling my own apartment? I'll have to find her somewhere else here, maybe. Or is it calling in here? Well, that's a lot of record players. Turntable. The big speaker. You guys even get speakers in building the wall? Oh shit. Oh, please. You piss off. Go away. Leave Tom Cruise alone. I shouldn't do this because this does more damage. <laughs> I shouldn't have called the phone yet. Now I have this asshole. Bothering me. Hopefully, he doesn't follow me in here.
Okay. Hey. Get me inside that damn apartment. What is this room layout? Oh my god. Wait, that that's not a no no. Might have to go back and get another free heal. Why can't I still hear the phone? Who is calling me? Heartless Florissant is giving off the eerie glow. Who here in the chat room is calling me? Phone is gonna drive me Munker insane. Oh. I don't care, I'm gonna go get another free heal. <laughs> I'm gonna go get another free heal. Although. Hmm. Yeah, I, don't, I don't think I should. I don't think I should give myself those notes just yet, because I don't know, I'm scared it's gonna advance the game. Which I don't want to right now. I kind of want to... A little bit more. <gasps> Wait, am I actually? No, you can't be serious. Right, Mr. Dante? How am I catching up to Mr. Junior? He's been playing this game for like four days or so, hasn't he? And I've only been here for like six hours. How how am I catching up to him? Ain't no way. I refuse to believe. And I'm even over here playing an Omega save. <laughs> how am I catching up to him? He's just going AFK. Okay, well, I mean, if he keeps going AFK, then I can see how I'm catching up to the man. What, is he also in that apartment block? There's no way. All those guys are back. Oh, there you go, now she's here. I'm making more progress than him at this rate. Yeah, I feel like we made loads of progress today. Like, absurd amount of progress in just these small six hours. Because there's only two murder victims left. It's just this green dragon. There's only two murder victims left. I don't know if we're close to the end or not, but yeah. I don't know, it just feels like we made an absurd amount of progress. In these six hours, like, we haven't gotten stuck at all. In any of the bits, really. Like, we haven't been stuck in a puzzle or anything yet. It's been, like, pretty smooth sailing. Only thing that's really been wasting a time is me, yeah, playing it really safe and keep returning to the apartment to get a free heal. <laughs> oh, but speaking of heals, I forgot to dump that first aid. Ah, well, it's fine. It's okay. 
Even though our inventory is full, it's it's alright. We can manage. Oh, <laughs> and he is the man himself. Mr. Junior in the chat room. Why is it humping the wall? That's what it looked like when it was running. Someone's enjoying a good meal in here. No, no man, it's just eat clutch. A fucking constant phone ringing. Got a shotgun? Ooh -hoo. Now I kind of, oh, hey, now I kind of wish I did dump my, uh, my med back. Oh. It's a model gun, so you usually as a weapon. Oh. Wait, these are, there's a fucking boarded T, there's a minigun even on the wall. Wait, is, does that mean the shotgun's not real either? Other guns are here. Other guns here are just models. Oh my god, here I thought I was gonna get a shotgun. What kind of tease? What about that one? Is that also a fake? Probably. Yeah. Oh my god, what a tease. Let me watch a party. Wait, what? <laughs> Excuse me? Nothing but books about guns. But one of these magazines has something written on the back cover. Excuse me, is Mr. Junior watching me? Is that what you're trying to tell me? What, what do you mean with Leo watch party? Is Junior watching my stream? Waiting for me to catch up to him because he's stuck or something? And then waiting for me to solve it? <laughs> so we can both progress? My eyes and skin are so itchy. That stupid cat next door made my allergy go crazy. I was so pissed off, I took my converted model gun and blasted away at the thing. Point blank range. It's very cool. The thing just dropped like a stone. By the way, the revolver that Richard in 207 carries is the real thing. That guy's dangerous. You can get a revolver. Yeah, what a tease, man. I was like so excited. Yo, they're gonna give us a shotgun and everything? But then it's all just model weapons. Well, let's go back and heal once more. Uh, heal up and then we go grab the handgun ammo. That was a hello boss. The god game boy has arrived. Right, remember to dump the med kit. It was only the handgun ammo, right? That's what I said I was going to pick up. I mean, I could dump this too. This is kind of just like a safety thing. Uh, actually, you know what? Dump the handgun. <laughs> Should I tap the handgun? 
Nah. If I dump the handgun, I'm probably going to end up needing it. <laughs> you know? So. We'll keep it. Keep it on us. Uh, right. Run to the last apartment on the left. <laughs> Grab the handgun ammo unless that's fake too. <laughs> nah, why would he have fake handgun ammo? You? Why would he have a replica handgun ammo? Surely the handgun ammo is real, right? Surely. Surely the handgun ammo is real. What the fuck was that? I don't know, like a race car. <laughs> okay, yeah, the handgun ammo was real. <laughs> God, I can't believe that still. That's such a troll. They put the shotgun down the kitchen counter. Get you all hyped up and excited, and it's just like, ah. Uh, just a mod model. Just a fake, just a prop. Right, so that's all of that taken care of on this floor. Alright. Yeah, it is. Now for the second floor. One oh six. A locker key. <clears throat> Wait, a locker key. Is it for this? Yeah. Here you go. I love you, Rachel. Mike. Filled with love letters from Mike to Rachel. What am I gonna do with that? <laughs> How is that going to help my case? Mm, okay. Well, at least I got rid of the key. <laughs> yeah, let's go to the second floor now. Yo, the phone's ringing on this floor. Only a cooking tools, but there's nothing I need right now. Hmm. What a small room. There's nothing else in here. I don't think I want to answer the phone yet. <laughs> oh fuck, the phone's ringing here. Shit. Don't answer the phone, it's a prank call. Why, why is there so much shit outside this apartment? Moving up. It's a whole lot of, whole lot of alcohol. Oh. 
No. <laughs> Stop smelling my ass. Get out get out of there. It's a bloodstained shirt. There's a torn red paper in the pocket. Oh, is that the other piece of that ripped one? Uh, hmm, I'm not too sure. Get out of the way. I'm not too sure, but I do. We want to answer the phone. I slip the notes first. I don't know which one's gonna advance the game, and I want to do the one that doesn't advance the game. I want to do both. If it's even possible. Hello. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. The writing is all blurry. I can't read it. Honestly, should probably go slip those notes. Surely that's not gonna advance the game. And <sighs> that way we can also clear up our inventory. Yeah, so we'll save the other wing. Oh, when we've slipped these notes, oh, the guy's no longer sitting here. This one? Yeah. Must be since the camera is all special here. Here you go. And have another one. And another one. There we go. Wait, yeah, do you want the doll too? Nah, you don't want the doll. You only want those red papers. I mean... While we're here, we could check these. No, nah, we probably shouldn't do that just yet. <laughs> let's let's just check the other side of the second floor. I've been here. <laughs> the apartment looks familiar to a different one. It's a barbell. There are lots of old game machines and other devices that I have no idea about. Oh. Tom Cruise is not a game or it would seem. They're all books about computers and electronics. What kind of console is Yo, is that a Turbo Graphics? <laughs> There are a lot of old video game machines lying around here. You know what? That wouldn't surprise me if that's a Turbo Graphics right there. Turbo Graphics 16, the Konami console. <laughs> it's a cassette tape. The label says skinned mic. What? I can listen to it on the stereo in my room. Ah, uh, yes, of course. Let me listen to a man getting skinned alive. Hmm. But I've always wanted to hear. Yo, leave me alone. What did I ever do to you? God, this one's fast. What's this? Absolutely nothing. Get me out of this apartment. Before Tom Cruise dies of a headache. What the fuck? 
A baby. A baby bird. Do you want the doll? No? Lots of kids' toys laying around. Excuse me. Oh, 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 excuse me. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my dog. I should probably heal. Use the first heal of the game. Men's bloody underwear and torn shirts leaving the garage. But he wasn't even there. I can see Elaine Galvin from here. Pretty sure that's room 303. What's she doing in this world? Oh, wait, is he the man that was pointing from the window? Oh, shit. What's this? This is the gun Rich I was using. Oh, yeah. I can actually use it. I wonder what ammo I would use this. Uh, I should probably heal. Wow, it doesn't even heal you. Heal you for that much? Alright, okay. We gotta make it to a hole. Oh. Get our health back up and come back in here. It's a golf club. Looks like it's a putter. Yo, we found another golf club. By the end of this, we'll have enough golf clubs to go, go for a few rounds of golf. Who wants to go golfing in Silent Hill with me? Let's uh, see if we can make it through the dark woods without getting out, without getting chewed into a 10 million pieces. <laughs> I mean, by the phone has been fucking ringing, ringing nonstop this whole time. Well, and I guess we could listen to the tape too. And we can read the notes as well. That I slipped under the door. Those are going to be free notes. Uh, who's ready to listen to a man getting skinned alive? <laughs> At least that's what I'm guessing is on the tape. <laughs> Damn, I could reach that dolphin pretty far away. <laughs> yep, got a handful of new notes. Uh, let's read the notes. Actually, let's check up on a friend here. And then let's read the notes.
doing her makeup, it looks like. <laughs> There's torn red paper stuck in here. So bloody, it's hard to read. Rachel, love you. Always watching. Window, protect you. But love, Mike. Wait, Mike? That's that's his name? That's the creep's name? Mike's love letter. Picked up the key that Eileen from room 3 or 3 must have dropped. Probably returned it, but she wasn't home. Guess I have to give it to the super. May 20th. I lost the key to Elaine Galvin's room. I uh, gotta find it and bring it back. Let me think. The last place I saw it was. I, I should have read that before I read that other one. <clears throat> I almost listened to this tape. You put the skinned mic cassette into the stereo. How do you like that, you sick little freak? You had it coming to you. His clothes are disgusting. Get him out of my sight. I know. It'll be perfect to wrap his body in. Hold it. You! Hold it. I think you I'll snooping around again? Myself. Get your ass out hold of here before it, you really it, piss me hold off! Hold it! Hold it! I think I'll keep that one for myself. Hold it! I think I'll keep that one for myself. What? There was three people in that recording. And now the news. There was three people in that recording. Who the fuck were that? None of them my neighbor. And then one mic, and then I don't know who the last guy would be. That's not what I was expecting to hear. Alright, let's put the, the Magnum in here. Or Potter. And the cassette. Nice. Okay. Alright, so what were we gonna do? Yeah, what were we gonna do? <laughs> what was the plan? I forget. I'll remember when we get there. I wonder if to pick up the phone. Road to be ringing this whole time. And then imagine it turns out to just be a prank caller. Right, so this whole floor is cool. Uh, what was in 207? Oh, wait, I think 207 was the one. Yeah, one of them's the kids' room and the other one's the point room. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I think we fully explored the two. Now we just need to answer the phone. Let me just double check. Yeah, this is the point room. And then I think the other one was the kids' room. Yep. 
Okay. And then that first one was the Turbo Graphics Room, I believe. Well, let's go into the phone and see what happens. Excuse me, I've got a phone to reach. Wait, oh shit. To the next room. Next apartment. Hello, hello. There's no one there. Oh my god. <laughs> it was a fucking prank call this whole time. <laughs> Their phone's been ringing this whole fucking time, all for nothing. No one, there's no one there. It's a painting of a young man. The memo says 107. He listens to great music. I feel sorry for him, having to live on the brain tea tree. Oh, wow, that's cool. Does the person that lived here, he drew the people from the different apartments on the opposite side of him. That's pretty cool. Painting of two adults and a lot of children. The memo says two is six. How can they even sleep with so many noisy kids? That's that. They have no. They have to live next to brain tea. Brain tree. It's painting of a man holding a brush. The memo says two or two. Self portrait. Huh? Painting of a nurse. And the memo says 106. Beautiful darling. Well, at least she's been bothered by a stalker. Is that one of me too? It's a painting of a plump woman. It was just two or four. She's always eating something. But I wish my girlfriend liked to cook like her. It's a painting of an old couple. It was just three or four. Nice sweet old couple. <laughs> well, that's all you have to say to that. How sweet. It's a painting of a woman holding a cat. It was just one or two. Loves cats too much and missed her chance to get married. I kind of feel sorry for her while she has while she was mourning for one of her dead cats. A cat girl. An old cat lady. Ain't painted yet. No, oh, that's just that. It's a painting of a man drinking alcohol. The nurse is too free. He's so noisy. I wish I would stop all the drinking and fighting. Painting of a man with a gun. Memo says 101. Gun maniac. He's always coughing from his cat allergy. <laughs> this must be the superintendent. Memo says 105. Sunderland. The superintendent. Super mistakenly. Super mistakenly thought that Mike was Rachel's lover. It's a painting of a man holding a Porsche <laughs> magazine. Memo says real one. That perverted stalker. He got what he deserved. This must be Richard Braintree. Memo says 207. Braintree, that prick. He's always yelling at kids. Especially that weird one that hangs around. But he took Mike into his apartment and peeled his skin off. So he's my hero. So he did get skinned alive. That's what we heard. Wait, what's this one? Must be the guy who plays video games. Man, what's this 205? He's always shut in his room. It looks like he has loads of weird interests. I heard he tape recorded Mike getting beaten up by Richard. This is a cool room. All the paintings and of the residence. Yeah, that was a nice room too, too. I know. Now we only got the free, the top floor, our floor left. 
What do we have, others? E. A key and a doll. What? We're almost done going for every single apartment. We just went, went for a painter's apartment. He had all sorts of cool paintings of all the different people that live that lives in this apartment. There was even a gamer who owns the Turbo Graphics. Turbo Graphics 16. Or whatever that thing is called again. A gamer? I know, right? Fucking gamers, man. We even games nowadays. It's so old school. That's so 90s. Who even would be willing to be a gamer and play video games these days? Must be a psycho. Must be a psycho if you'd want that. He says while gaming. Dun dun dun. What do kids do nowadays to make YouTube channels, yeah? Make YouTube channels and then they just film themselves and vlog all day long. And shove that camera in other people's faces. Filming themselves flipping bottles. <laughs> yep. And then they completely lose it when it lands like upside down or something. <laughs> like, whoa, oh my god, whoa, Jesus Christ, what the fuck? How is that possible? I think it's like Galvin's on the other side of the store. And then freaking out like, holy shit, what the fuck? I didn't even know what the key, I think it's like from the inside too. <laughs> the video gets 10 million views, yeah? That one's a puff, right? For somewhat reason. I guess, I guess that's what people like to watch these days. Feels fucking weird, man. Wait, what? Where? Where? What? <laughs> we went through all the rooms. Did we miss something? Mm. Let me look at my notes. I don't think we missed anything. I found something that extremely... Oh, wait. Not this one. Alright, let's key... That's the key to only get out of room. I've gotten it. I gotta find it and bring it back. Let me think. Did I not get the key? The key that I ever free must have dropped. I thought, he, I thought I returned it, but she wasn't home. I guess I have to give it to the super. Wait, what? <laughs> Did I not pick up the key?
Any keys? Any keys in the chat room? Trying to run through two together with the pot. Oh, I guess maybe we, we might just have to return to the real world. That could be actually be it. Leave me alone, you drunken ghost. I went the wrong way. Hey man. Anything new? Anyone calling your phone? Don't seem like it. No new note. It's still just this creep staring into the people. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's literally the peep peephole guy. And us throughout the whole game. Sp sp spying on our neighbor. Staying in the Leo's room. <laughs> Don't go out, Walter. I didn't want to read that. Staying in the Leo's room, like, hey. What's up? Hi. Oh, the father Martin. Father <laughs> Martin walks up to my people and says, hey. Nah, he's not there anymore. Father Martin stare. Rare spam. I didn't put any key items in here. I only put this. The table might get skinned alive. I probably missed something in that one room where we found the gun. Uh, no. Oh, and I also have too much ammo on me. There you go. Right. Looks like my door looks. Yeah, right? This is your average uh, door look, right? Oh, don't, doesn't, don't your door look like this too? Of course it does, right? Can't be too secure, you know? Can't be too secure in your own house. Must be a pain in the ass, though, to unlock when the pizza guy shows up. He's like, oh, hey, wait, wait, give me a second. And then he just hear all these chains so can getting unlocked and dragged on the floor. Well, the pizza guy's waiting on the other side. <laughs> like, hey, hey, yeah, give me a second, Mr. Pizza Guy. <laughs> then when you open the door, he just sees all the chains laying on the floor next to it. Oh yeah, I mean, I, uh, that's true. I still have this wine bottle in here. 
I never have to do anything with that. Opening the door. Opening the door. Yeah, can he just slide the pizza through the the letter letter opener thing? This door doesn't even have that. Yeah, probably no door has that anymore. The little gap that would be for your for the letter to get to fit through. Let's save here, cause oh, I think that might be it for tonight. Yeah, I'm pretty tired. Can't really focus that well anymore. So that might be it for tonight. Almost a good seven hours. We shall continue, of course, more with more tomorrow. But day eleven of the Silent Hill Marathon. Yeah. That does it for tonight. I like how in the beginning I said this was going to be this was going to be one of the hardest Silent Hills. Turns out I was very wrong. This is like one of the easiest ones. <laughs> we made so much progress today, and like, there's no boss fights or anything so far. It's just like smooth sailing. Exactly. I have I have to go unchain the door. Take a solid five minutes to <laughs> remove all the chains and then put them all up again. It's, it's a lot of work. It's a lot of work. But it's worth it. This can't be too safe. Yeah, that's it for tonight. <laughs>